Hello, travelers. I'm Chris. Welcome to Lore Spire. We're going to be continuing our uh, co op um, multiplayer uh, playthrough tonight. I'm here with uh, Jen and uh, Sam, who are playing Vakira and Ravinda. Unfortunately, Unsung had to bow out for tonight, so I'll be playing the part of both Chris and Craig. Anyways, um, yeah, what are we uh, what are we up to tonight? Um, I know we had Raphael's House of Hope on in the cards, which is why I named the episode Raphael's House of Hope. Um, are we wanting to just go straight there? Do y'all want to try to do some other stuff first, or what's what's the plan? I say we go straight there. Yep, that's fine. All right, we'll go straight there. Cool. Of course, I don't know where there is, so. Well, we got to get into Baldur's Gate. Um, have we been into Baldur's Gate yet? No. So we got to go to Worm's Rock and then. Should be able to get through, right? Let's rehearse this one Yes. Oh, I need to crag though. <laughs> I'm forgetting crag. Burn it to the ground. Burn what to the ground? I don't know what you're talking about. Where do we go? Worms Rock? Yeah, Worms Rock. I spoke to a witness who says you can't so my feet can carry me. I have a pizza on its way, so I'll have to be the, to grab it in a couple of minutes or about a half hour. All right. I thought you were off today. I am, but I'll be back. Uh, I'm not. Okay. I'm All right. Here. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah, I went out. Okay. All right. Well, I guess you're allowed, I guess. Yeah, no way. Yeah, pizza rocks. I'm sure pizza rocks would taste good. Not as good as pizza pizza, but. What? You like cardboard? Did I go? Did I go the wrong way? I went the wrong damn way. Whoops. Turn around, go the other way. <clears throat> Tell you what, if you put some cheese and some sauce on cardboard, hell yes, I'll eat it. Ah, there's the brain shakes. The brain is breaking free. Oh no, that's what not I good. Tell you? A momentous occasion. Ah I'm shit. I'm sure you agree. And to think, the drama's just started. You see, Gortash has had. Don't we no have one of the stones? Yes, we do. Yeah. So why can't we help control it? Um, I think we can actually remember we talked to Gortosh and we told him that we would kill whatever her name is the crazy one and take her stone and then bring him the stones and together we would control it with all three stones which I'm pretty sure he plans on killing us at that time <laughs> yeah oh I'm I'm we'll sure I'm sure and even if he doesn't I plan on killing him at that time so it's definitely not gonna be all three of us with the our both of us with all three stones. It's going to be either our group or his. If he doesn't plan to kill us, he's definitely going to die. Anyways, uh, where where has he been taken? To his death, the way I hear it. Such a shame. And to think there's no way to save him. Or is there? Hey, Jose, don't forget to uh, join. Still the first five minutes. You got 40 seconds. Unless you already did, in which case, disregard. My, aren't we eager? Let's meet Will <clears throat> in your camp. Work something out. The Duke's life depends on it. Yeah. I'm not that keen on going back to camp right now. I've got enough spells to last a little bit. Like, nothing crazy, but I can go for a bit. 
Okay, cool. Then to the lower no city key. we go. I have no key. You have no key. Oh. All right. Are y'all wanting to go? You, we need to go rest then. Do we have a short? Rest? I think we should be. Yeah, Let's we we should a, have a short a rest. Waypoint, and then there should be a waypoint here, right? Yeah. As soon as we zone in, I think there's one. As soon as we zone in. Because I do believe the plan was to rest before we started running around, but that's okay. It's been a few days. Is that the plan? Have odd things. Have a plan? Oh, wait. I think I have a potion. If you just give me a few minutes, I can drink it and just uh, sleep for two turns, and I'll have my full rest. Uh, I think you should save that. Like, that's way too valuable. I can't make those, and I've only found, like, three of them, like, in the entire game. And I have a feeling, like, at some point, like, at the end, we're not going to be able to rest. You know? I think I may have actually given them away to you guys. Uh, I think you did give me one. Uh, yeah, Yomogami, I had to, like, defrost it and clean it, like, and do a bunch of stuff. It took me a few hours that night, but, uh, I did get it fixed. It's not perfect or great, but it's at least working still. So, yeah, it'll it'll be good for a while. One day I'll catch a break. All right, so here's the waypoint. Got it. Y'all want to just go rest then, or do y'all want to find Raphael's house and then go rest, or what? I can't move. I don't know what's going on. I think I didn't load in properly. Still thinking. Yeah, I see you with the skeleton popping out of your chest. I don't see anybody. I see dots on the screen. It should be people in front of me, but I can't <laughs> see anything. Yeah, you need to get a screen grab of that skeleton. Thanks. Oh, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. No, don't move, damn it. Don't move. All right. I got it. Oh, actually, let me get one with F10. Yeah, that's much better. Very nice. Very nice. Two-headed Rivenda. I'm going to pop into the camp and then back and see if it fixes it. <clears throat> okay. No, 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 I can't because nothing's activating. What's going on here? Okay. Well, then great minds think alike, Yomogami. You and her have some great minds. And that made the mini map disappear. What the hell is going on over there? I don't know. It's probably the skeleton's fault somehow. Uh, I'm going to have to restart, I think. All right, go for it. While you're restarting, we're going to go find Raphael's house at least. I'll be right back. Yourself. <laughs> that felt great. You 
very welcome, sir. Alright, I am returned. My apologies for that. Now let's go find that hell house. Hope house. Hopeful hell house. Whatever it is. Let's do it. Can you invite me again? Oh yeah, I can do that. You're already back? Oh, uh, hopefully. I'll give it a try. Alright. You should have the invite. Come to have a go. Give it your oh, best shot. One of these days. An air of decay hangs over the stooped beggar's form. The smell of rot. The smell of death. Gold first. Then you can hit me. Try to focus on the beggar, but the smell is too strong, too nauseating. Perhaps the cause is better left unknown. Nope, I'm not paying to punch you. Okay, I just um, bought us or rented us the whole floor at the uh, tavern. What? You just rented us the whole floor at the ta That sounds as expensive. What the hell? I didn't know you were rich. <laughs> uh, no, he's trying to get business back from because um, people are spooked because somebody got murdered. A d duke got murdered up there. And he's like, no one will stay there. Maybe you should show him that it's fine to stay there I'm like okay what could happen with a murder in a fantasy game yeah um so we're gonna go rest there and then we're gonna be accosted by ghosts or murderers or somethings maybe um we could speak with dead ah. I can move speak now. with who dead Ah, speak with dead. Yeah, maybe so. I can move now, but I can't see any people. And there's no sound. Did you close the game out completely? Yeah. Are you on your new computer? Yep. Hey, it was running perfectly last time. I was just asking. Just curious. Sound. Oh, shh. G -g 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 okay. Ghosts! Thought I thought at first, but no, it's just Isabel and the angel. They're here. Alright, I'm gonna do it the hard way. I'll be back. Oh, that right. spy kid's here too. The spy kid? <laughs> Don't kill him. All right, I don't want to have to restart. I wasn't the one that was trying to kill him. I just was questioning him and told him to leave. All right, well, if you want to tell him to leave, go for it. But no attacking. That doesn't end well. Since apparently angels can't be killed. And even though they can't be killed, they won't come and fight with us. Oh, I like the music in here. Hey, two ladies Midwest. How you doing? Oh, How you doing, today. my friend? Thanks for uh, showing up and hanging out. My father. He should know what happened with Ansel. No, we've not gotten the second staff yet. We're kind of on our way for that, Cobra King. Since uh, you told me about that. Um, Thor says that the murder investigation is a fun quest. 
Mind flayers are like devils. They just sport tentacles rather than wings. Clever, manipulative, exploitative. The Emperor says he's a friend. I think we'd be fools to believe him. And maybe it's true. Maybe Stelmane allied with a mind flayer and subjected the city to their political will. Or maybe he made an offer she couldn't refuse. Not everybody do will, not everybody accepts those kinds of offers. All right, so we're going to rest here, I guess. Let's go ahead and rest. See what this murder investigation is going to be about. What's that, Sam? I picked the wrong chat channel when I said, hey, I'm back. Oh. Uh, I don't see you to send an invite yet. Fina, Cirrus, arbiters for the Hells, exemplars of justice. Your parasite links with wills, and your memories flow into him. He sees his father's flight from Worm's Rock, and hears Mizora's words, do you? Shit. Where did Gortash send my father? How do I save him? Sisters. You gotta Infernos promise yourself to her again. Te vocamos. Infernos <clears throat> contractos te vocamos. Oh, Infernos contractos te vocamos. No frickin' way. Your contract, Will. Signed in blood, forged in fire, bound in bone, but not unbreakable. No contract is ended without sacrifice. A cost must be paid. Will. Raven Guard, a choice is before you. Option one, I show you the way to your father. I guarantee him no harm except that from you and your allies. And you pledge your soul to me and the Archdevil Zariel in a pact eternal. Option two, I break your pact and you are freed from your duty. Your father dies by his enemy's hand and Baldur's Gate loses its greatest champion. Name your sacrifice. Mizora, you asshole! Choose. That's pretty nuts. That is pretty crazy. I had no idea about this. I still don't see you to invite. Down 
I'll be right back. Okay. You damned wretch! Father... Do it. Break the pact. Fiat Ita. Fiat Ita. Anima ad beator. Didn't think you had it in you. <laughs> Seems my boy's all grown up. And I really like that character, Mazora. You made your Yeah, choice. she's awesome. You knew the terms. You know what? I think I'll stick around. Not for the greater good, you understand. Just for the entertainment. Well, we broke the pact. I agree, two ladies, we broke the pact uh, for sure. That definitely seemed like the coolest thing to do there. The best thing. And tis done. Tis done. Alright, I what guess does, we go um, back to sleep now? What was Masora's reasoning for want, wanting Will's father dead? No, oh, she said that, um... That, that in order to break a pact, that you have to make a sacrifice. So she made us choose either we had... Like, somebody else has his father it's not her or at least that's the way she presented it um you know but they are going to kill him so she was going to help us save him but we'd have to bind will's soul to her and zariel eternally or you know she would let us make the sacrifice of our father or will's father for uh in exchange for will's freedom Ah, uh, so, so like she was just sacrifice basically make, she's, yeah. she's being a bitch she's being a yeah bitch. okay i got it <laughs> Yeah. The answer was just because she wanted to. <laughs> yeah, just just because she wanted to, you know, watch Will, you know, torture Will, basically. I'm back. Can you see me in Steam yet? Uh, possibly. No. The hell is going on now? I don't know. I see a Treyu and I see High Queen Jen. And that is it. Signed in. Yeah, I agree, two ladies. I like the father would probably prefer it that way. And even if not, a life isn't worth a. An eternal soul, you know, even if it wasn't his father, even if it was like somebody else. All right, who wants to talk? It said somebody wanted to talk. It's got to be Will, right? Yep, it's Will. I've got a long road ahead. One day I'll catch a break. Correct. I didn't. If you must know, I was scouting the cultists on behalf of Zariel. But those cursed shadows were thick enough to fell even a half-fiend. I woke in that damned pod. It kept my body sealed and my most powerful... I should speak I can up. see you in the chat. I failed. Well, let me check again. Ah, I do see you now. I have sent you an invite.
Ah, uh, okay. Well, maybe we will end up there then, Thor. If we find that other quest. Ah, you broke the pact with Will and saved the father, Matsy. Interesting. <clears throat> Maybe we'll still get a chance to do that, possibly. You make it in yet, Ravinda? Not yet. No? Okay. That's weird. More weirdness? Well, I don't know. We may not uh, we may not get much playing done tonight if whatever's going on is going to continue Team to go on. Baldur's Gate is running. But my task manager doesn't. Yeah. Hmm. Well, that, um, I mean, sometimes wow. Steam will show that a game is running for me and I just got to hit the stop or the play button again for the game and like it'll correct itself. Although if you haven't tried to open up the game, I'm not sure why it would say that it's running, but unless it's trying to open it because you accepted the invitation or something. Actually, it doesn't say that you accepted it. It, it just says that you're invited. Yeah, I hit accept. I don't know, is there like an internet issue in your area right now or something? Because it sounds like there could be. Seems could like be maybe that, your I mean, like, connection is just not very good. Discord went fine through fine. Yeah. Well, I mean, Discord is just voice, though. I would imagine the game is a lot more... Um information intensive way more data packets to send and all that kind of jazz hey the gentleman ghost hello uh, all new to the channel been watching all the co-op videos finally caught up well thank you gentleman ghost we definitely appreciate that i'm sorry we're having some technical difficulties right now which is why we haven't uh, gotten on to uh, Raphael's house of hope um, we're trying to get it ironed out, but I definitely appreciate your support and watching all the co-op videos. And, uh, yeah, be sure that you do enter our giveaway $25 Steam gift card. Every, um, every single stream that you show up to, you can type exclamation mark lore spire like Matsy did right there. And it will enter you to win, uh, the, a gift card. And we have the, the giveaway every single Thursday night. So every single Thursday night, you've got a chance to win based on how many streams you've seen and how many times you've typed uh, exclamation lore spire. Anyways, whether you're into that kind of thing or not, it's definitely awesome to have somebody new here in the community. So welcome. I'm going to restart my computer. I'll be back. I thought you did just do that, right? Yeah, uh, something else is going on. I don't know, so I'll try it again. Okay. All right, give it a shot. Uh, you ready to rest, Jen? Uh, yeah, sure, just a second. Okay. I was just chatting with some of the NPCs. Go ahead. Yeah, no problem, no problem. I just figured we could get the long rest done and maybe we get visited by a spooky specter or maybe not, I don't know but at least we can get it out of the way one way or the other. So vain. <clears throat> oh, 
Well, it shouldn't matter if it's set to private or not if I'm sending an invite. Okay, so we were not visited by any ghosties. So I don't know what was supposed to start the murder mystery happy hour or whatever, but um, apparently I wasn't sleeping here. Although it's very nice, much nicer than our camp, so that's a plus. All right. I do believe I'm going to continue to look for the House of Hope. Don't forget to hit those like and subscribe buttons if you aren't already subscribed. Really, really helps us out. Free way to show some support for the channel. Get this out to as many people as possible. It's definitely very much so appreciated. And right now, while I'm thinking about it, I want to go ahead and thank our Patreon Senior Council Member Supporters, Lich Lord, Sam H., and Poop Smash. Uh, thank you all for all that you do and all the support that you provide. Really, really does help and makes a lot of what we do possible. I'd like to also thank Random Nathan and Simeon for uh, supporting us at various levels on Patreon. And I would like to thank Poop Smash once again, as well as uh, Greg R. Thel S., Evil Taco, and Malphus the Swift for supporting us with Lore Spire channel members, uh, uh, Lore Spire YouTube channel member uh, subscriptions. So thank you all for that. And like I said, uh, free way to support the channel. Uh, you don't have to do all that stuff. Just make sure that you're subbed and hit the thumbs up button. Give us a like. Much appreciated. All right. So if I were a hopeful house, where would I be? On a beach. On a beach, maybe. No, it's definitely not there. I'd remember if it was there. But, 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 but that's twice what you just said. I'm oh, is this the park? Oh, I'm sorry. I must have missed something. Two Ladies Midwest Adventures. Uh, you've got your own YouTube channel? Tell us about it. If you got your own YouTube channel, I want to know about it. Let me know uh, who is we and uh, also what's the channel about, uh, what do you do with it, so on and so forth. You know, give us some info. Maybe some people will be uh, interested. And if you already did that, I'm sorry that I missed it. You, you know have my apologies. I do, but they as we do. Hey, can you see me in uh, Steam now? Your voice sounds really low. Uh, just an FYI there. I don't know if you did something different. But um, yes, that is better. I, I do not. Voice. Okay. I do not see you in there yet. See, it's, it's it's almost it's almost like you're lagging. Like you can see us, but like the internet connection is not good enough. Like we can't see you yet because of the lag. Maybe at least that's what makes sense to me. Yeah, according to this, I have a great connection. Well, then maybe it's something else. Maybe it's on Steam's end, or maybe it's oh, there you are, there you are. I see you now. I just uh, sent you the invite. Okay. Let flowers say what words never can. Hey, okay, this time it seems to be running better. A simple joke and local adventure channel. 
Julieta and Jenny loves torturing me, Dad. Okay. All right. Well, that's cool. That's cool. Well, welcome to the channel and uh, the community. And if anybody's into uh, jokes and adventures, uh, maybe go check out Two Ladies Midwest Adventures. Is this it? I think this is it. I'm not 100% sure, but I think it might. Yeah, I think it is. Let's find out. Knock, knock. Yes, this is it. Okay, I found it. And there's the shopkeeper that has the best staff in the entire game. Give it to me to now. The devil's fee, where every hellish curio is a rarity. So merry be and shop with glee. Oh, I just subscribed oh. to your channel. I'll check it out after the stream. Oh, nice. Awesome. Thank you, Jen. Appreciate that. Yeah. Woo! Go, Jen! Yes. Yeah, so... There you go. Got at least uh, one new sub today. Need wisdom checks yeah, all around the first floor. A... This time I got an all-black screen. This is great. Uh, wisdom checks are my domain. Uh, where are we going? Uh, we're in the Devil's Fee. I don't know. I was told that they sell the best staff in the game here, but... Something over there. She did not have it for sale. Maybe you have to make a wisdom check. Maybe that's what they mean to, uh, to be able to access it. This head's a long way from home. Belongs to one of the Fugue Plains Death Devils. Well, I found one thing. You can see me on the map, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Oh, perception check fail. Okay, that one passed. Never seen a gem like this. Bet it's a fake. Must be a diabolist running this shop with so many devilish artifacts. Oh gosh, silly That's thing. Uh, the kids outside are talking about playing Chase the Gelatinous moves. Cube. But barely distinguishable from oh, the really? <laughs> what to do? Sounds like a fun game. Uh, it explains why their ghost imitation his cubes don't but chase things. Don't get from chased, the they thing. chase. Imitation horns, but barely distinguishable from the real thing. <sighs> okay, so I guess just walk around here and make all the checks on things that we might have missed or something. This artwork is more foul than fine. It fills you with an <clears throat> uncanny sense of dread. Well, that was better than I got for it. Mine was just like, oh, these must be fake. Ha 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 ha. Gems inside those boxes. Yeah, I don't want to just steal from her though. The portrait's eyes seem to follow you around the room. Did it just wink at you? Uh, there are a couple of boxes around here. Maybe you can check them out. The display cases. <clears> 
<clears throat> I just asked me to open it, but it's red. Well, according to Cobra, you're supposed to examine it. Within the crystal, you see the devil Raphael sipping from a goblet of blood red wine. Oh, yeah, there's not even an option to... He smiles uh, as he catches your eye. Can you can you examine see? the other one, at least. A real fiend skull. By the size, I'm guessing a gargatula. What about this one? And this is the only one that can actually be examined, I guess. So maybe this is the one he's talking about. Infernal gems, straight from the heart of Minalros. Quite the rarity. Okay, well, I don't know. I guess that's it. Maybe we're supposed to use some of these items to build the freaking staff or something. I'm not sure. But, oh well. It'll be okay. Unless now maybe there's like a new talking option. Your possibly. esteemedness returns. It keeps crashing on me. Oh, joyous hour. Can you try your other one or? Yep, that's what I'm going to do. Switch computers. All right. Your Give horde of minutes. genuine... Okay, cool. Your hoard of genuine infernal gems is quite impressive. Show me the really good stuff. Ah, okay, you did it, Jin. It seems like you did it. Well, well. It's been a while since I've had such discerning custom. Here, you may browse my more curated selection. All right, thanks, Cobra King Kiss. Thanks for the... Uh... The advice there. A shapeshifter hat. Increase your wild shape charge by one. Gemini gloves. Cantrips targeting foes and allies can target an additional creature. The same target can be chosen twice. That seems pretty good. Cloak of the Weave. You gain a plus one bonus to spell save DC and spell attack rolls. Holy balls, I want that. Absorb elemental damage once per short rest. Take half damage from the next elemental attack targeting you and deal an additional 1d6. Okay. Still don't see a staff. Or I guess there is a staff here. Is this a staff you're talking about? Because I'm not exactly sure this is better than the other staff I had. Still for only 300 gold. You back again, Sam? Wow, that's actually pretty cheap. Do you use cantrips much, Jen? Uh, not really. Not anymore. Okay. All right. I'm going to go ahead and grab these gloves then. Well, the upstairs is certainly interesting. Yeah, the upstairs is how we actually get to the House of Hope. All right, so yeah, those were definitely some really good items, so hell yeah. Glad to have those. You guys hear me? I can hear you. See how steam's going. 
You already have advantage on concentration saving throws, right, Jen? There's like a hat here that gives it to you. But I figure you probably have Warcaster or something. <clears throat> okay. Well, she does sell a hat if you're interested that gives you advantage on concentration. Now you've uh, seen what I have for you. Remember, discretion okay. is key cool. at the devil's feet. Yeah, that she has now is phenomenal. <clears throat> oh, do you have the Baldurans helmet or whatever? The legendary one? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that one's definitely better. Definitely better. I would uh, probably keep that as well. Did you get the invite? You sent it to me. Whoops. It well, that's not right. So. Okay, so you said... Okay. I sent it twice, so I guess I screwed up and sent it to Jin one of those times. My bad. Now... Hmm, what's that? My most perceptive, prospective customer. Welcome back. Alright, so... I think we may have to actually trigger Raphael before we can go here. Because she's supposed to give us like a spell that gets us into the house oh well that's nice I just got blown up so yeah that was that was that was pretty nice that was pretty nice so I guess we're gonna have to go do some other stuff until we trigger Raphael and then we can get into the house go back to the murder room yeah yeah we can do that um did you see any clues or anything there before um just a bloody bed and a guard but i um i just left without talking to her cool cool finally i got a decent cloak finally what is my Bill. Celeste signed up for a channel membership. You are awesome. Hey, Celeste. Uh, I'm not sure who you are, but thank you. You're very, very awesome. You're very awesome. Thank you for the channel membership, my friend. That goes a long, long way towards supporting us. It is greatly, greatly appreciated. Thank you so very much. Oh, you can just kill her and loot the items? Oh, hell yes. Thank you, Cobra King. All right. Is anybody up for a little uh, vendor murder? I know that's Sam's favorite thing, vendor murder. No, no, it is not. Yes, yes, I'm it okay is. okay with stealing from them, but not killing them. Well, maybe <laughs> you can pickpocket it from her then. Because they, they're saying they're saying that uh, we don't actually have to trigger anything with Raphael, that we can just kill her and take it, which presumably means that you could pickpocket the stuff off of her. Of course, that means we're also going to have to break into her upstairs, past her fire traps and all of her other stuff. And yeah, it's not necessarily going to be easy, but I'm sure we can probably manage. <clears throat> Oh, nice. A new, uh, I got a new ancient sigil, uh, transformation thing. Portal. Portal. That's the word I'm looking for. Ah, we are not murder hoboing because Sam doesn't believe in that. Um, if it's a vendor that's involved. So we're just 
stealing hoboing. Hobo stealing? Something like that. Or murder hoboing because you trigger fights all the time without realizing it. That is not true. We're forced to defend ourselves. That is not true. Sometimes I trigger the fights on purpose. True. I was about to say, have you watched your own videos? They're just coming Actually, right for us. No, I don't. <laughs> it's coming right for us. Oh my god, I love South Park. Oh, I love it. Sorry. What do I think? I think I found the issue. There was an update. I am so glad you are. Yeah, you're updated now. Uh, on this computer. Yeah, I think the other computer was not having it. No time to chat, mate. Sorry. Since Gortash donated this printing machine, we've had ridiculous volume to shift. Did you head back to the inn already, Jin? Yeah, I'm over there. Okay. Yeah, I'm basically there as well. I kind of took the scenic route, but... Oh, the Elf Song Tavern. There's somebody in here we're supposed to be... Oh, no, we didn't do the murder mystery thing. Okay, yeah. If we, if we had solved the mystery outside, then there would be somebody here we're supposed to meet. Is she still here anyways? Murder sounds better every day. Hmm. If I wasn't such a coward, I'd join a cult of bar. That puffed up parvenu, Gortash, an archduke. Mm. However did they find a crown big enough for his head? The two ladies says that oh, with some NPCs you can just purchase quest items? Huh. I haven't, I haven't come across that. Purchasing quest items, but, uh, you know, maybe I would not be surprised. They seem to have thought of everything in this game, and it would make sense that, uh, you know, everything has a price and all that. There you are. I'd almost lost track of you. Almost. Good to see you again. Even if you have put me out of pocket. The boss bet me five soul coins you'd reach the city in one piece. Speaking of Raphael, did you miss his invitation? He's waiting for you in Charessa's caress. Oh, okay. So if we want to talk to Raphael, we go to Charessa's caress, it looks like. Then go on miss him and hurry up. Devils are patient by nature, but even Raphael has certain limitations. He'll be in Charessa's caress in Worms Crossing. Go now, if you know what's good for okay, you, you and the world. Invite now. I most likely can. Okay, I sent the I'm invite. Really it shows that you're away. Times a charm. Away though. It's 12th? I thought it was like 22nd. Murder sounds better every day. If I wasn't such a coward, I'd join... Oh! Matsy, I did the same thing! Didn't you see me do that on stream? I ran up to it, I pushed the button, I died, and then they wouldn't revive me as punishment for pushing a button. But yeah, yep. I've been there. I feel your pain, my friend, or I feel your friend's pain, I guess. Alright, so any luck finding out anything about a murder here, Jin? Are you hot on the trail? Uh, we just gotta talk to this guard in here. A guard? Okay. Is the guard upstairs or? Yep. Ah. 
No fresh vegetables. I'll take the handy shit. Damn the absolute. Take nothing else, it seems. Oh, yeah, down here in the. Yeah, yeah, I forget about that a lot. But, yeah, you're absolutely right. I should probably do that more often with the uh, the icons and seeing what people have for sale. A ritual killing, maybe. But that's not how those absolutists operate. Oh, it's her. She's the one we were supposed to meet. Okay. Oh, bollocks. I told those idiots not to let anyone through. You. Name, rank, and reason for interrupting an active crime scene. For your sake, the last one better be bloody good. Very good sign, I have uh, Chris, adventurer, curiosity. An adventurer? <laughs> Fantastic. We don't have enough of those in Baldur's Gate. Unless you've got useful information, leave me to my work. Duke Stalmain's dead, and I've got to find who killed her. Let me help you. I trained under Camber Fosrick, the world's greatest investigative mind. I did. It's a true story. Suppose it couldn't hurt. We're scraping the barrel as is right now. Here's all I found. The Duke was <coughs> paralyzed by poison. Absolutist symbols scrawled on the floor in blood. Hand removed, pre-mortem. The symbol's the bit that bothers most. You use poison when you want to get away with murder. So why leave a symbol at the scene of the crime? Doesn't make any sense. And the removal of the hand. I have a theory, but... Oh, well, you're a civilian. That one will be for me to follow up. I've been working on an assignment. A side project of sorts. I think the removal of the hand is the key. But I just can't figure out how. Corpses without hands are showing up all over the city. Together with dioramas of death and murder. It has to be connected. The brutality of it. The unnecessary brutality. My theory is... That it's got something to do with the Lord of Murder himself, Baal. The higher ups don't want to hear that, of course. The last thing they need is public hysteria about a cult that was supposed to have died out over a century ago. <sighs> yeah, great. That's the right word for it, Matsy. Great. While this uniform gets me into certain places, it keeps me out of others. Is that the Lord is here? How you doing? Is that the Lord? I believe it is. How are you? Finally in. Taking his time to load yeah. stuff, but I'm here. Yay. You're, you're, you're sure? Yeah, I just walked into the room with you. Okay. All right. Sweet. Sure, we'll check Perfect. out the ball of three surgeons. Unofficially, mind. As far as the higher-ups are concerned, you're still just a civilian. If you end up breaking any laws, well, I won't be able to help you. Report back to me if you find anything. You know, you know there's a map of murder you. on the desk table there, right? If I'm right, you'll be doing a great service nope, to Nope, I've been talking, so I've not seen a map of murder yet. And then there's notes on the murder on the other table. There's something missing. Bloodied ring. Guess the killer didn't want jewelry. All right. They were after the hand. So, do we want to go see Raphael, or do we want to go try to track down these murderer peoples? There's something. What did you find, Jen? Let's have a look at myself. You found wine? Maybe it's poison. Discarded wine bottle. 
This wine's poisonous. All right, so we found the poison wine. I don't know how that helps us, but we found it. Quite right. Nasty paralytic agent. Explains the lack of struggle. See, two ladies says that there's load of goodies all over the room. I don't see any other ones. And perhaps y'all already grabbed them. Lots of blood. Yes. It doesn't look like she fought her killer. Strange. Okay, so none of that really helps. You're good, Sam? Mm-hmm. All right. All right, we want to go back and meet Raphael then. Sure. All right, cool. Yeah, the uh, ads used to be optional, but um, they've taken away the option now. Like, the only option I have is how often they play, which I put it on the lowest setting or the lowest frequency. So hopefully y'all aren't getting too many of them. But it used to be I could turn them on or off for live streams, but now I can just, like, turn them down, not off. <laughs> Well, that's good. That's good. I gotta admit, this is well, so hard. To, with the uh, this computer is so much slower than my new one. Oh uh, yeah. Oh, well, maybe you can just like swap some of the parts from your new one to this one so that. I don't know. I don't know. The other one plays uh, Starfield great, though, I guess, huh? It has been, yeah. Nice. Where are you going? I think this is Shores's caress. Yeah, this is it. So Raphael should be in here somewhere. There's Carilla, who told us to come here to see Raphael. What's up for discussion? Maybe I'll talk Go to her. see Raphael. Then I must... Well, he's here somewhere. You have the Almost painful. Anybody see a devil anywhere? Well, he can shape change, you know. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's true. Maybe we should just talk to everybody. few coins are way. Look at me. 
A new face? Looking for another chapter of dirty law for your biography? You have but to ask, and we can grant you a moment of pleasure. Don't be shy. Well, you're obviously not Raphael. Darling, but other anchor in for spice. Game. Play. Go see Raphael. Oh, oh, oh. I didn't see this back here, maybe. Nope, that's the kitchen. All right, I'm about to give up on Raphael. I have no idea where he's at. I wish I could kiss you better. I mean, to try. The two men bark softly to each other. A single name reaches your ears. Nine Fingers. It's a name you know. Nine Fingers is the head of the guild, a criminal organization operating inside Baldur's Gate. Seems everyone's got business with her. Heard the game. The new kingpin? Oh, Can meat and that? muscle, that one. Oh. And wild as a werebear. If he's looking to house nine fingers, my blade's got his back. Sounds messy as the ninth hell. Must be why she called us to help. Is that right? The way I heard it, you Zent cut a deal with the new. Hold on. Hey, you still lurking about? I don't remember inviting you to the party. Are you sure this is the right place? She's right here and she tells us to go find Raphael and she points that way. Which is what way? Well, talk to her. She's at the bar. She said that Raphael's waiting for us at Charesse's caress, and then we came here, and she's here saying that we need to talk to Raphael. So that's that's what I know. Look, this subject's not safe. You selling your services, beat feet to the Guild Hall, Lower City, Basilisk Gate, Guild Hall. And that's all you're getting from me. Now, Scrum, the chat's officially closed. You rented a room hey, upstairs. I just got some said he rented a room by. upstairs in the hopes we'd drop by. Yeah, just yep. there is a locked door. room up there. <laughs> yeah. I forget we've never met. I've had my eyes and ears on you so long, we feel like old friends. Carilla is my name. I'm Raphael's assistant, shall we say. Take your time. Have a drink. Sample the goods. Go see him when you're feeling refreshed. All right, so I guess it's the locked door upstairs. I wonder if we know anybody who can unlock, open a lock. Very naughty. Very naughty indeed. I can't think of anybody. I know somebody who can break down a door, though. Let's go attack that door. Oh, there's two sets of locked doors up here. Oh, I found him. I'm glad you came. Not to my door. Not yet. 
but to the final reckoning. One more Maybe thing more than before two. we begin, though. For the first time since the Nautiloid, your mind is clear. It's unsettling. That was no party trick. Somebody's missing. Can't you tell? That illithid you keep in your pocket can't hear us anymore. I'd ask you to be patient, but you've been patient enough. Now is the time to speak plain. I'll admit, you've impressed me. I wasn't sure you'd make it this far. But no matter how far you come, you're still on the road to ruin. A road that leads directly to a confrontation with the Elder Brain. At best, it will kill you and everyone else in this city. At worst, it will assimilate you and you won't have enough free will left to even wish you were dead. You have the key to destroying it in the palm of your hand, though. Very perceptive. Yes. I can give you the means to break him free. Well, this is different. The Orphic Hammer. An artifact capable of shattering the chains that hold Prince Orpheus is held securely in my House of Hope, even now. <laughs> Such an eager little pup. Surely you realize there is an exchange to be made. You scratch my back. I scratch your parasite. You really do think highly of yourself. My sights are set on something much more valuable than your soul. <laughs> Succulent, though it would be. I want the crown that dominates the Elder Brain. Yo, what's up, Malphus? How you doing? You're awesome. How you doing? Appreciate you stopping by, as always. Better to have it in my hands, and far from your precious world, than in the hands of the gods and monsters that fight over this city's soul. Power. Ancient and full of wonder. I have craved it ever since the Archwizard Cassus created it long centuries ago and brought doom to the Empire of Netheril. That was the great age of humanity and Netheril's flying sky cities were the apex of civilization. I was there the day it all fell apart. Entire cities plummeted from the sky like angels with broken wings the screams oh the screams hundreds of thousands of people watching in horror as the ground came up to meet them 
<laughs> it was not a happy meeting. And Cassus was responsible. Not driven by malice, but by ambition. He forged a crown imbued with all the powers of magic. A crown that would make any who wore it a god. Men cannot contain so much power. The crown destroyed its creator, and his empire fell with him. Cassus's folly, the bards and scholars call it. I call it hope. The hope of creating a better world and the perils of unchecked hubris. I knew then that the folly of mortals could be the triumph of devils and that I could use that crown to unite the nine under one. Archdevil Supreme, me. So he wants to overthrow Asmodeus? That's what it says. Uh, like. It would <clears throat> seem so. It would seem so. Not a smart thing. Uh, no? You, uh, could he really be worse than Asmodeus? Yeah, I'll take the crown and use his power myself. <laughs> Oh, I'm, I, I'm sorry, you were serious? <laughs> the crown has laid low all who attempt to harness its power. Archwizards, emperors, gods. It would take... I'm more powerful than all of them. I'm the protagonist. It shan't do that. You know what? I'm sure you'd make a fantastic You're arch devil then. Kind and extremely insightful. With the crown, I would impose perfect order, unity, efficiency, control. My kingdom would control its borders and stay within them. It was stolen from right under my nose. All those centuries ago. The archdevil Mephistopheles snatched up the crown and squirreled it away in one of his vaults. He is not more than a frigid archivist. So much power and potential kept inert. He made a miracle into a museum piece. I raged. But only for a decade or so. Then I waited, ever watching for more than a thousand years for a mistake, a mishap, a misadventure. And these chosen, who have caused you so much trouble accidentally, did me a favor. They brought the crown back into play. Yes, it does. Especially when I see what a bloody mess they've made of their whole scheme. They must have raided Mephistopheles' vault. Impressive, I must admit. But they'll be dead soon. If you don't kill them, the Elder Brain will. It doesn't have feelings in the way you'd understand them. <laughs> but it seems rather angry. It is inevitable. When you destroy the brain, and you will because you must, the crown will be yours for the taking. And when that moment comes, you give the crown to me. In exchange, I give you the hammer now. A simple transaction, it seems, but it's more than that. He's offering you an alternative to the mind flare in your head. Take Raphael's deal and you could free Orpheus. With Orpheus free, you would have no need to rely on the Emperor. But there's no guarantee that Orpheus would be on your side. And if you take the deal, you'll have to fulfill it. You'll have to deliver the crown of Carsus to the devil himself. 
He claims his hey, ambition devil. is to unite the Hells, but can he be trusted to stop there? Do you trust him more than you trust the Emperor? What do y'all think? <clears throat> uh, Vakira says no way. Jen says no. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I think Vakira has more sway here than Jin. Sorry, Jin. No deal. I'm leaving. I also don't agree. trust him. It would take him centuries to. But time is running out. Oh, well. So, if you see reason, I'll be here, waiting. Right up to the moment the world ends. Yeah, he just pushed us out of the room. Yeah, I think he teleported us. All right, now we should be able to go back and break into his house. I thought I'd lost you. Something was blocking me from hearing your thoughts. Okay. What about yeah, these other Raphael. doors? Raphael. Uh, we can go through those if you want. Well, I know one of them's involved with the murder mystery us. quest thing that we of don't course. have yet. I should have known the devil. The other one, I'm not sure. The stench of impending chaos is irresistible to them. And what did he want with you? Now who you stuck in a conversation with? Uh, with the Emperor. He offered me a deal. How very gumptious of him. What were the terms of this deal? Tell me. You turned him down. I turned him down. Good. I am glad. But be careful. The devil is like a cockroach. No matter what you do to it, it will always. Do you have any idea back. what ending we're trying to go for? I doubt this will be the last time. Absolutely Lord. not. That's sacrilege. I trust that you will continue playing with the intent to get a particular course. ending. Without my protection. Nope. You cannot defeat we helping the emperor we helping the devil we helping orpheus no matter what those are our choices right now in your ear. yeah i don't know i think we're helping ourselves oh, Father, give me strength. i don't trust the devil or orpheus or the emperor but of the three i think i trust orpheus the most possibly the emperor definitely the devil the least oh uh, i just like, want to be not even it's not even close player. A what? I just want to be a free willed mind player. Ah, okay. Who has? Well, then I suppose we can. I suppose we can go with the emperor then, if that's how you prefer to to take it. But you can be a free willed mind player if you side with Orpheus too. Oh really? Okay. Well then, maybe we'll do that. All right. Are we going to try to break in here? Do y'all want to see what's in here or not or what? Nymph's grotto. Doors open, isn't it? Let's I see two locked doors. That. All right, I'll pick the lock. I'm tired of waiting. I'll take care of it myself. <laughs> it's not giving me an option to pick the lock. Oh, and what have we here? I don't know, but a little a whole bunch boudoir of business. Get that door open. Tell me, am I am beautiful? I beautiful? More than beautiful. You are the aurora stretched across the north skies. You Two ladies says that there's supposed to be a way to get the entire party to become mind players. Yeah, I already turned that down. The last, the last tadpole. Yeah. Soft on my skin. Happy Labor Day, Malfus. I guess Sweet I should have been saying that already, tongue. huh? You are my sin and salvation. Your parasite stirs. And you gaze at the nymph through the flaming fist's hungry eyes. 
Your muscles shiver with her longing. Your skin burns with her heat. What's... What's wrong, Jara? What are you? Wait. I know you. Uh, you aren't safe. Get out of here I now. I don't understand. What's... Your face. The Absolute has shown me. Jara, what's going on? I can't believe you guys on? picked open their door Who's to go watch. Demons. Your head screams in agony. The change has come. Pustules boiling beneath your skin, your bones twisting, your flesh rupturing. And suddenly, silence. What's happening? Something gave her the order to transform. And the brain just had another brain quake. I'll strike you down. So yeah, apparently all the uh, absolutes people. Uh... Hey, what's up, Vakira? You uh, you enjoying yourself there? Yeah, nice just watching rest? the fight. Yeah, was it entertaining? Where's the popcorn? All right. Where's Raphael's? Um, I will be right back. We got to teleport back to the other area. Jen oh, is in a conversation, so we'll let her... The very last uh, oh. portal that we have. Oh, I'll be yes. right back. John. I will miss her coin, it's true. Her gaze intensifies. Your breath quickens, and the woman's senses are heightened and her fire stoked. The mind flare is no mere curiosity, but an object of desire. Desire is instinct, to both mortal and immortal. It's no more disgusting than the mulberry fresh on its bush. But perhaps there are other flavors that might satisfy my palate. <laughs> Not sex. Something far more intoxicating. Nachos. Rapture. Close your eyes and listen. The gods themselves cannot grant you my unimaginable bliss. Refuse it once, and you will be left forever wanting. Then a part of you remains forever empty, yet keenly felt. An ultimate unknowing beyond your grasp. At least take these. May you have at least some comfort in bitter times. I won't forget you, and you won't forget me. All right, I'm back. Come back. I don't even know who you are. She's a dryad, or something like that. Um, you get a quest from the lady downstairs, the blonde lady, and she'll tell you to like come up here and investigate whatever happened to her girl. And then you can like find this, but I don't think it really matters if you find this first or not. At least not that I'm aware of. Alright, are we ready to go? Yep. Okay, I believe it should be lower city central wall. 
I believe so. That brings us all anyways. Ha ha ha, Matsy. Damn, I wish I'd have read that sooner. I'd have been like, oh yeah. Should have got some more tea while I was up. Hey, Malphus! Oh my god, I can't believe it! You upgraded to your membership to a Lore Spire Super Supporter membership? That is awesome. Thank you, my friend. So much support you give us. So awesome you are. It is very, very much so appreciated. Thank you. Yeah, hell yeah. Thank you. Okay, so it should be, I think, where is it at from here? Yeah, it's straight north. So if we go this way, yeah, right here. Loading in for you, so give me a moment. We'll talk later. Uh, still I loading. welcome okay. thee to the Devil's Fee. I'm in the room every with you, hellish but... curios are rare. There's no walls and things so yet. So merry be and shop with okay. glee. Okay, so yeah, we do have the option to just talk to her and give her, get her to give us the stuff now. Um, so we don't necessarily have to kill her or steal it. Although, somebody just did something that pissed her off. What did you do, Vakira? I just looked at the vase. Yeah. Picked it up and moved it Must be a, a very bit. important vase. I don't care about being nice to freaking fiend worshippers. No. Customer. Welcome well, back. then you're gonna... Never mind, I don't want to give anything away. Never mind. Truly, that's remarkable. Associate I with the devil, with you might remarkable. as well be the devil. Very and I guess well. we're devils. You stand before We've been associating with, with one since like four or five hours into the game. You turned My him down. Is not information, not In every opportunity, you turned him down. Not really. I guess I that's break true. people into the hells. That's my thing. Greg has to cast uh, a long strider on us. What a fascinating proposition. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Ludicrous, I mean to do that. of course. But fascinating, nevertheless. It's not like there'll be Very any battles well. or anything, though. If you wish to die in Avernus, that's your business. Mine is charging you for it. Of course, such a task will require quite the substantial donation to Lord Mammon's 20,000 gold. Yeah, Such you can. Huh. Do not even the Emperor doesn't want us to do it. Yeah, you know what? How about you waive the fee and I'll bring you one of Raphael's artifacts for your collection? Because I ain't paying you 20,000 gold for anything. You put me in a difficult position, mortal. You are almost certain to fail. <clears throat> almost. 
And so, there is a chance you might succeed. Fine. I'd like to be able to carry all of my precious stock without the need of a team of oxen. There are gauntlets of hill giant strength within the House of Hope. Free passage, and you fetch them for me. Deal? Deal, let's do this. Allow me to outline how this is going to work. First, you were never here. We never spoke. Second, you will perform the rites yourself. I want absolute deniability. Here's the grimoire and necessary components. So are we ransacking the place is what you're saying? Oh, take this key too. It unlocks the ritual. We're going to the house and There's a blood taking whatever drawn. we want. Don't ask whose blood. Along with the are grimoire the and components, and she's, Helsic she's helping us. a note containing precise instructions for performing the ritual. Finally, you were never here. That is of utmost import to remember. Now be gone. At least the traps upstairs should be disarmed now. And just as an FYI, Bakira Malphus uh, strongly or says it's a hard degree that if you associate with a devil, you may as well be a devil. So seems like you got the support of the community behind you with uh, with that one, Bakira. We should be able to just open it, right? Yeah. I strongly suggest that you reconsider this course. Wow, of the Emperor really does not what want us to do this. To summon? Opening a hell gate. Uh we need to put the skull at the top. And then the coin of Mamon. On the next point to the right, so skull, coin. Oh, that's weird. Huh? I actually failed at a uh, lock picking check. Yeah, well. Does. That's been bad. Oh, it's gonna be inside the bag, okay. Did that just destroy the skull? No, it's right there. Okay. I thought it was. There we go. All right, now the coin. This coin is freaking is hard to see. What? Is everything there. in the, uh, in the summoning thing? Or yeah, it's in the pouch. Bells and books. I guess you can loot them. I don't see why you can't loot them. Okay, oh, what's next? Here. Um. Counting clockwise, skip a point and then place the diamond. So next we need the diamond. Then the incense and then the marble in the center. Okay. We're almost done. Incense. And then the marble. All right, we're using devil magic. We have to go into the Ready hole. whenever y'all are. Yeah. All right, we're here. We're here. We're officially trespassing in Avernus in a devil's house. 
I'm sure it's going to turn out very well for us. You came. Such a shame. Curiosity killed all the cats. It won't be so kind to you. As the woman speaks, you hear a distant rattle of chains, and she winces in pain. <laughs> the children will hear us. I shouldn't be talking to you. I must go. It's not kind to me. All right, we will attempt to intimidate her later then, two ladies. But you sense she could be convinced to return. I actually like her. She's a really cool character. The figure shimmers brightly. Your words seem to have piqued her curiosity. I hope so. But it is a faint hope. Just like me. I can't leave. I could only suffer. But I'm supposed to do that in silence. Everyone here hates me for what I am. I'm the thing that kills you and the only reason you're alive. Made by a promise and done by the truth. A handshake, a hug, the first beat of a newborn's heart. I am hope. What little is left of her. A guttering candle in a universe of night. I'm not much of a friend to anyone anymore. But I could use a friend myself. Do you want a friend to guide you through this madhouse? I hear the jailer. It hears me. It'll call Raphael, make every question count. Make some of them count twice. Discovered an ancient gate prince in need of a savior. The Orphic Hammer is the perfect tool for breaking all infernal chains. Hope can help. The hammer is here in this house. It's... You hear a sound like the rattle of a chain, and an agonizing scream in your head as Hope flickers from view momentarily. here is mad even you especially me and that makes them dangerous but it also makes them stupid i'll make you seem as ruined as the rest of the people here a simple glamour to make you a terrible wretch <laughs> now whisper your questions little wretch but really quiet and very clever concentrate Remember that time that you turned into a table? You were really quiet then? Sure. All right, let's do that. Remember, quiet as a mouse. The same place you'll find your sorry little soul when Raphael rips it out. In the archive, down the corridor, past the debtors. Oh, the debtors. They won't like you. But I like you. I know I do. I think I do. I hope I do. I just need to ask one question, and I'll know for sure. Can you see it, me? Please, 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 please. Of course. You don't even know how. All right. You have to listen very, very, very closely. I will say this only once. Find the key, take the hammer, smash my chains. Find the key, take the hammer, smash my chains. Find the key, take the hammer, smash my chains. But be careful when you take the hammer. The fire will come, and Raphael, you must run, 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 run. But don't forget me, please. Please, please. I don't want to burn. Not again. The rattle of chains echoes louder from unseen places. And without a scream or a sigh, hope disappears.
And she is gone. Um, guess we need somebody to pick a lock. Unless is the other one locked? I don't know. No, the other one's not. Creeping, stalking. I can pick this. Falling. I see you. Did you go through the other one though? Uh, yeah, yeah, I did. But you can pick that, and then we'll have them both open. That'll be good. Let's see, that's the way to hope. The outer portals are closed. Okay, that one doesn't matter. Right, I'm just orienting myself right now. Inner balcony. There should be like a vault somewhere around here with some good treasure in it too. Okay, ah, I found it. Awesome, good job. That might be worth a little. Oh, you snugly kept me away from finding the vault to loot. I get it. Well, I think the way to get in here isn't actually unlocking it, though. It's like you got to make an Arcana check or something. I'm not sure. It's oh, it's a Wisdom check. Uh, Dan. Hi. Or Vakira. We need Vakira. Um, I mean, I, can I back out? I can't back out of the check, so I guess I'll give it a try, but it's probably not going to work for me. Oh, never mind. It worked for me. Oh, and then, then the next one's an Arcana check. So it's a wisdom check first, then an Arcana. Okay. All right. Damn it. I failed that one. All right. Ha. I'm the best vault breaker in her. Ooh, treasure. Are we rich? 666 gold. An appropriate Some number, I suppose. Oh, and a staff. Staff of the stone. That's probably what you're looking for. Yep, that's what I'm looking for, all right. I was told that the other one was better. See, in magical and ordinary darkness, up to a range of 12. You cannot be blinded, and you get a plus two magic saving throws against spells. Attackers can't land critical hits on the wear. Oh, that's like, I like that. Yeah, yeah, pretty nice, pretty nice. I like to watch the door to the boudoir. I like to see who goes in, who comes back out, and who never does. Okay, that's very nice. Now, somewhere around here, there should be the room with the hammer and everything else in it. To put my hands on everything. Over here! Hello again, little mice. The price for speaking Maybe this one we're all kind of pointing to it. <laughs> Is just yeah, ahead of probably. The archive, but you can't take it yet. And even if you could, you mustn't. Trigger the alarm, and Raphael don't know where will come swooping is. home on wings of malice to rip out your soul. And this house thieves are some... melted like butter and spread onto toast. Shh! I'm doing it again. I'm doing it again. I can. 
I shall, I can, I shall. The archivist is the key, but he's as stubborn as a king and as serious as a heart attack. Exploit his fiddling weakness and make him grovel! Oh no. They hear me. Speak quickly, speak softly. You know how this goes. You hesitate a moment too long. I don't hear a thing, Sir Jailer! Except for the gentle Ooh, cracking of my wrist. I better not. Hope vanishes from sight, and the house seems to tighten around you like a constricting artery. Okay, so it's such an interesting uh, read. Uh, okay, cool book. I will definitely be sure to check it out. To watch the story unfold. Well, well, well. Look what we have here. So, on either side of the glowing hammer, there's going to be the item that you want and the other item that we're supposed to get. And then we've got to find a way to break the shield around the glowing hammer, which is actually going to require access to the boudoir for us to do. There are traps on the pedestal. There are traps on the pedestals. Whenever you go to try to steal the amulet and the gloves, by the way. One moment. All those consult the visitor's schedule. Well, fairly decent at dealing with traps. Yeah, I would imagine. Just giving you a warning. Most irregular. The schedule is all but clear. And yet you are here. So you want me to try and steal that stuff? Well, I mean, it's the stuff you wanted, so yeah. I mean, at, at the very least, the neck piece, and as long as you're at it, you may as well grab the gloves. I'm sure you can do it. I was able to do it with Shadow Heart, and she's not half the thief you are, so. No visitors yeah, expected. But I'm not discovering Other than Carilla Hearthflame and Virilius Receptor, Zariel's High Inquisitor. I am Virilius Receptor, Zariel's High Inquisitor. I am, I am. Really? Oh, screw you. Those are some really thousand nice apologies, O oh majestic magistrate yeah. of the Infernal Court. Your mortal guise is so vile, I found it perfectly convincing. I would prostrate myself before you and kiss your calluses, but my spine is ruptured in a thousand places. I wonder why I'm not seeing you the know traps. how Raphael likes to play. As always, the archive is yours to peruse. You'll find everything I suppose for. it is possible Can that I on balance difficulty there are no traps assistant. there maybe and did you fell any perception checks no then maybe there's not actually any traps there on balance difficulty they do show up as stealing so if I it <laughs> might trigger an event something it might take them mm. so most drolls in inquisitor as you well know, the crown of Cassus is lost, stolen from Mephistopheles by gods kissing mortals. There we go. My master protection. certainly had nothing to do with any of that business. An exquisite and most unique artifact, crafted with materials hewn from the depths of the hells by Raphael's Merrigan labor force. As it was created by Raphael himself, we have no documents of procurement, nor do we require any. But if you wish to examine the artifact itself, you are more than welcome. As part of the special collection, that item is guarded by a master word that even I do not know. I suggest you wait until Raphael returns, and you can discuss the matter with him. 
You are welcome to relax in the boudoir until then. It is where Raphael conducts his most private matters of business and pleasure. You will need this to gain access. The resident of the boudoir will wish to explore every inch of your new form, and I'm sure you will be happy to share. You done with the rat? All right. So I guess now we're yeah, headed to the, the boudoir. You got the gauntlets. Nice, and nice. The amulet. Where you? Guess All right. You. So you should have the most hit points of any of us then. I haven't put it on yet, so let's see. He's going to notice you nosing around his house. I hope you're ready to face a very angry me. This is home base. I'm not even going to ask what you're doing. 113. Plausible deniability. Might want to steer clear of my sister Hope, though. She's mad as a March hare. If she just agreed to serve Raphael, he'd probably have released her a long time ago. As things stand, Do I want to she's his the 23 as well. Toy. We're all mad here. But hope and hell? Okay, where did you go? Why? That's the definition of insanity. The uh, thing I gave you explains why she's mad. Oh, yeah, I already know why she's mad. She is. Though we've got about as much in common as a princess and a pauper. Raphael offered her the world. She didn't want it. He sweetened the deal. She said no. No matter how many times he upped the ante, she just laughed in his face. He didn't like that. Eventually, he took her by force. Trapped her and swore he wouldn't let her go till she gave him what he wanted. Conversion. The stubborn ass has endured more torment than any soul should be able to. Even when he took all of her skin, she held on to hope. Raphael finds that puzzling. And he loves puzzles. You being here is another puzzle. You don't seem like you want to die. You want my advice? Enjoy whatever life remains to you. Okie dokie, I can enjoy whatever life remains to me. Yep, plus 14 for a nat 1. Hey, sometimes it's good to be good. And yes, hope is definitely a roller coaster. That's putting it mildly, politely, something like that. All right, now we can heal in here. I guess we don't actually need to. But you can actually heal and restore all your spell slots here if you ever find the need. Not see where you went and you're not showing up on that. Curious. Went to the boudoir. A lost little mouse is running through the house. A thief in the night, greedy and here to take. Why are you here? Raphael all but spent himself to get that hammer. And you want to take it off him? This is very naughty. Whatever are we to do? Why don't we play a game? You win, I give you everything you desire. <laughs> but you'll enjoy yourself more if you lose. There is one way to leave here alive, darling. 
play with me, pretty please. I'd hate to have to kill you. You will make a pretty feast. We're supposed to kill this harp left guy. Uh, look at his uh, HP. Yeah. Iron 69. <laughs> That's perfect. That's perfect. That is the best HP. I am so. And cool. we don't actually have to kill him. We probably could have like played his game, possibly, but I wasn't gonna do that. He disappears whenever you hit him sometimes, or maybe every time. I don't remember. Like an ethereal shift to another plane or something. Oh, I can attack the bed. Go for it. So you only get to hit him once? Uh, like I said, I don't think it's every time, but it could be. I only fought him the one time. I'm actually more interested in where his helpers are, because I remember there being helpers. Uh, do I have a C invisible? Mm, you can try it, but I think... He's on a yeah. He's not on yeah, this. Yeah, it's plane. like he's like in a different plane. Yeah. Okay. Well, then I'll just end the fight, end my combat turn. Ouch! She charmed you. Use your target of chaos. There's the helps. Another step forward. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What's gonna suck is whenever I start busting out the high level scrolls. Uh, maybe it's a charm with the concentration effect. There he goes with the escape. Too bad that doesn't break the... Uh, Craig should have stayed beside him so when he walks away you get the free attack. Yeah, that might have been good. Hey, what's up Malphus? Uh, we're fighting Raphael's lover. That's what you missed. There's the help.
Damn, that's a lot of imps. Really wish I had some AOE to use. Yeah. Dang it, Chris. What? I just counterspell you? Good, knock some sense into me. That's what I was gonna do with uh, with Crag, but he didn't have enough movement to make it there. I think every time I take damage, there's a chance for it to break the charm. Hopefully. No, I think it's just a turn thing. And said he can save if he takes yeah, damage. You can make a saving throw whenever taking it's damage. Yeah. It's also a turn thing. So it's both. Miss? That's not right. There you go, you got a crit to make up for the miss. the movement to get there why won't we run with that <laughs> all right well you uncharmed me so thank you for that And yeah, I guess it is every single time. Which is kind of annoying. Is ever easy. But oh well. Yeah, I couldn't get that fourth one though, which annoyed me. Yeah. Oh, there's a Camby in here now? Nice. Freaking great.
was a Cambian. Yep, no mas. All right, now if we can just finish this jerk off. I am so fast. At least he didn't stun us with it. So that's good. Really immune to hold person? Lame. Thank you. You want me to try and uh, knock them out or something? I would say just get over to uh, the devil so that whenever he comes back, you can get an attack of opportunity on him. He's only got like 40 hit points left, so maybe if you do that, we can finish him this turn. If I can attack him on my turn, I could kill him, but... Ooh. Well, that Back sucked. Hole. Yeah, Smart. he did. Little bastard. So don't hit the devil, guys. I can kill him on my turn. My minimum damage is 32 or something like that. All right, then I'm just going to skip mine. Be right back. Somebody's knocking on the door. I skipped my turn. other attack part missed. Down to 18, 13 hit points. Craig still dominated. 
Uh, no, he's uh, done. Good. Flat. That might be worth a look. Stuff, stuff to Chris. Send those to Akira. Key went into the key bag, didn't it? Where's my key bag? All right, so I take it we won. Get them. Hooray. I got a key, but I don't know which one it was. I have 29 of the damn things. Here it is. One for Raphael's safe. Send that to Chris. Uh. Oops. And I sent some gloves to Vakira. All right. We got what we need now. Here's the password. Now we should be able to take down the magical barrier around the hammer and we can take the hammer. I think we might want to heal ourselves first though. At the ready. All right, whenever you are ready to go for the hammer, let me know. We'll head that way. Currently stealing clothes. Okay. Found a copy of the Quarta Sune. Isn't there a place in Baldur's Gate where we can get into the magical vaults and you can get that last page of the uh, Necro? The Thane, I, Necrom, uh, book. Probably. I have no idea where it's at or how to do that, but yeah, it would make sense. I know that there's supposed to be another page still somewhere. Why can Raphael's bed be destroyed? Why can it be? Yeah, just wondering why. I don't know. Can it be? I was able to target it. Yeah, you weren't able to damage it, though. Vengeance. The most delectable of poisons. Exhibit. 
wholly unique. <clears throat> See, where's that? Uh, Taming Hope Part 2. I got it. Do you need it? I picked no, it no. No, we don't We don't need that. Um, we're just waiting for you. Uh, whenever you get over here, we just got to say the magic I'm passphrase. I'm standing uh, behind you. Oh, okay. All right, then. Hocus Pocus, Abracadabra, so on and so forth. The Orphic Hammer, right within reach. Is that thing trapped as well? Or? surrounds the item. Nope, it's just got an invulnerable barrier that prevents us from touching it unless we know the magic phrase. Magic mm. words. Which we learned from what we got out of Raphael's safe. The magic blinks away at your words. The Orphic hammer is within reach. What do you think? Your theft won't go unnoticed. They should run and hide. This is delightful. You have what you wanted, but you cannot leave lest all hells break loose. <laughs> uh, <laughs> a hopeless situation. <laughs> All right, so do we want to save hope or not? I guess that's the question. I've got good news. Yeah. yeah you said you would. A bad news. A okay. worst news. G good news. You got what you came for. Successful visit. Great success. Fantastic work. Bad news. Probably worth I love her. So many things will be on fire when you step outside of this room. Yeah, it is. You included. That's okay, no, right? It's hell. You expected it to be hot. Worst news, Raphael's on his way home, and oh boy, oh boy, he is. Spitzing mad! But you planned for this. I know you did. You have everything under control. It's really important that you don't panic, even when your eyes evaporate from the heat. Come to my prison, bring the hammer, break my chances, then we exit stands any which way. Quick as a cockroach, lickety split if you don't mind. Hey, Threed, 3D, how have you been? It's been, uh, it's been a while. How are you, my friend? Glad to see that you could drop by. Yeah, the War Tales stuff was fun. Sadly, we weren't able to finish it, but it was pretty cool. It was pretty cool. I'm glad that you, uh, enjoyed War Tales, too. At least you're here now for this. Oh, I freaking hate these things. So annoying. What do I have to lose? Why is Hope still here? I thought we freed her. No, we have to go free her. This is just her spirit. We have to go free her physical body. You actually fight that giant rock? Come on, can't stay idle. Yeah, you have to destroy it. The hell spear. Yeah, it's fun. The pain in the ass, actually, but. Wait, do I have? Oh my god, I don't even have one. Mage armor. That's not good. Oh, and you know what else? We never put on uh, our our thing from Crag, Longstrider. No nope. mage armor, no Longstrider. Need to oh, do that after this combat. Nice, nice. Glad to hear that you got BG3 playing a chaotic good necromancer. That's a little bit different. My single player playthrough where I'm kind of close to finish with the game is a necromancer. 
Dark Urge Necromancer. And the Necromancer is freaking phenomenal. Love it. Love it. Yeah, I was planning on trying to do that, Matsy, if they're on board with it. Oh, nice. Nice attack of opportunity. If we could, we a uh, uh, short rest would be great. Yeah, we can short rest after this. We should still have two of them, or we can go to the fountain again. You didn't restore your stuff at the fountain. I didn't know there was a fountain to restore stuff at. Oh yeah, in the boudoir, there's you can walk into the water whenever you first walk in there, and it'll like restore all your hit points and key and everything. I told y'all about it. Things are just so annoying. They're, they're so resistant to damage, and then they have so much life. They're not hard. All right, two ladies backing me up on that. I did tell everyone. Nice, nice. I remember you mentioning a, a fountain. I just don't remember where it was. Ah. Uh. Well, it kind of makes sense, Threed. Um, that's why my Necromancer, the RP with it, is like no acid, no fire. It does make sense if something's like burnt to a crisp that uh, you might not be able to... Ha! It might not make a good undead thrall. those little minion things like that they explode i forgot about that whenever you kill them and then they turn into something else may the gods take you first step forward i want to take a short rest Time to get going. Feel that one later. If we class ten, come on. No, you can use animate dead in the middle of combat. I've used it in the middle of combat before. Notice that necrotic or ice damage uh, stops their bodies from being resurrected. Yeah, that is kind of weird. I hadn't noticed that. Yeah, we're going to go to the pool before we do anything else. Sorry. Survival is all that matters.
Oh, you haven't even gotten animate dead yet? But yeah, you can use it in the middle of combat. It's if nice using it as a necromancer. A I love the skeletons. What's that? If you're actually playing as a necromancer, don't choose it as a spell at 5th level. You get it for free at 6th. Yeah, that's a good point. You do get it for free at 6th level. I still chose it as one at 5th level because I didn't want to wait a whole nother level. But, yep, you do get it for free at 6th level. Yes, you can use it in the middle of combat. Absolutely. Promise. I promise you can use it in the middle of combat. I've used it in the middle of combat. I mean, Dextra, from what I heard, he just kind of data mines everything. So maybe his data mining was off. I don't know. But yeah, you can, you can definitely use it in the middle of combat. Now, I think there's another spell, Create Dead. It's like a level six spell. And... I haven't actually used that one yet. Maybe that one can't be used in the middle of combat, possibly. But animate dead can be. Anyways, I actually really like playing a necromancer. It's not... As far as the pure classical like idea of a necromancer goes, I think it's done better here than it was in Wrath of the Righteous. Although, if you just want a power trip lich, then yeah, that Wrath of the Righteous is definitely better for that. Uh, that's a good question. I'm not sure. How much experience? Has anybody noticed how much experience we're getting for this? 210 for that last kill, it looks like. So, you know, okay amount, I guess. Yeah, agreed. Power chip trips in general, Wrath of the Righteous is pretty damn good at that. But for roleplay and for story and stuff like that, uh, I think this game might be better for that. At least in a lot of ways, if not every way. to ask yeah let's go ahead and do that let's go ahead and do that um Now we're actually ready for combat. After like however many combats we've already done. Let's get going. That's one way to do it. Now I figure it's better to blow it up before we got close to it.
I think this is the last one of these damn hell spheres, or at least I hope so. I freaking hate Sweet these things. My feet can carry me. I hope this Hellfire isn't as bad as the um, one in Divinity. That stuff sucked. Oh, uh, yeah, th this stuff isn't really that bad, no. Like, it, I think it's, like, actually an aura. Like, if you just move, like, a few meters away from him, it'll stop. It's not even something that stays on you if you move away from it. So, yeah, it's definitely not nearly as bad as the, the Cursed Flames or whatever from Divinity. That... That did suck. Yeah, you knocked it back a little bit. Cool. All right, now if we go up here, we should be able to... Oh, damn it. Should be able to get to the boudoir. Open up. Need to find a way forward. Oh, there's gonna be one damn more, isn't there? There you go. Been a little while since I've seen you bust out the hand crossbows. I thought they explode. They do, but you missed the second time. They explode whenever you get them to zero hit points. Double misses. Right, yep, on. double misses. I can't target this guy. There we go. Okay. Craig's about to die. Stay on my feet. Yeah, he'll be fine. Okay. Think you can take me on? Lucky. Can just use all your spells in a 
Yeah, that's that's what I'm saying, Matsy. That's why I'm not really too worried about it. We're about to hit the fountain, and we'll be full health and the spells and stuff after that. Oh, it's my turn. Jeez. Maybe I just didn't end my turn. Fog. All right, we're all blind. Um, You're welcome. Yeah, they're worth a lot. Alright. Right here is where you can restore everything. Fine. I think you gotta actually be farther in the water, Bakira, because it didn't get you. There you go. All right, now we can go back this way. It only does it once. No, it'll do it however many times you want. You can go back there and restore it however many times. All right, this is where hope is. seal yep the prison hatchway you just click on it uh yeah yeah we can click on it oh boy levers and buttons and buttons and levers. And I'm the only one down here. I'm waiting yeah. for you. Oh, you're already down there? Yep. Oh, hell, I was waiting for you. Okay, I'm on my way. I didn't realize you'd already gone down. I could see you on the map, and I guess you're underneath, though. I'm Don't staring at a spectator. Down. Yes, you should be. So we go up through this door? Goes nothing. Yep. I just lost sound. Yeah, well, that's probably not good. Hit the button. See hope. Petrified debtor. You have to worry about that, don't we? I don't see. Oh, you guys went the long way. No, we don't. Yeah, I I went the only way that I know to go, which is down the hatch. Oh, I crawled through the rocks. Okay. Cool, cool. Well, I guess we can uh, come at them from two different sides then. We're you ready? So we go to it. You have to take Hope care so. of these red rocks. Ultimately, we have to destroy the red rocks. If we do it before the battle's over, then I think hope will help us. But if we want, we can just kill the enemies and then smash the red rocks after that's done.
I wish I had some way to... You guys can do 27 damage to the spectator, he's dead. Maybe eventually, but uh, not just yet. Oh, are we not even in combat? Sometimes the only way out. No, okay, I'm in combat. Jen doesn't look like she's in combat. Oh, she definitely is now. Spectators? Yeah. Oh, this one over here is almost dead. <laughs> don't know if these things have knockback or not. I don't actually think that they do. Oh, well, I was wrong. They do. So, better be careful about that. Uh, I think that was uh, just knocking it down. Oh, did you not go backwards? Okay. Oh, that's a little bit more of a relief then. Are there three spectators? No, there's only two. Nice. Aye, aye. That should make it a wee bit easier to kill. Yeah, I had a 95% chance, so I figured I should probably go ahead and take it. You gave the hammer, wielder, fly, and haste, and they got hope out super quick. I don't know, to me it's just easier to just kind of kill them and then worry about hope afterwards. Well, Jen has a stone all basically to herself to go beat up on. It's just two imps there. <laughs> oh, we have to use the Orphaic hammer to destroy the gems. Mm. So, you know, we can kill all the enemies and then we can bust out the hammer and destroy them. Try me. Really? It's got one hit point left? Weak. Spectators worth a thousand hit points. Or a thousand experience. Yeah, a thousand experience? Yeah, they're worth a lot. Yeah. They're not very hard either. The still watch is harder. And they're only worth like half as much. knocked it out because it was a pommel strike that's why it only had one hit point left okay anyways uh -huh. 
Yeah, it is a good area for experience for sure. We should be getting... Yeah, we're getting pretty close to level 11. It gets ass, Jen. You can do it. Damn good start. Where are the rest of these over there? Greg. Not communicating again. Hey, I jumped first. So you did not communicate just as much as I did not communicate. There was one closer to you, you walked by to come over here. Where? Right here. Are we supposed to free these debtors as well or no? Um, I don't know. I guess we could. I didn't actually try it, but I guess we could. Yeah. Nope, that didn't free it. You need a basilisk oil. I'll try freeing them then if we have any. See, see what I happens. could use Greater Restoration. That's a level five spell slot for them. I mean, no, I mean, we are gonna to we are gonna restore. Yeah, we're gonna restore our spell slots. So, not too big of a deal. Just turned to dust. I never thought I would be believed I could be hoped I might be. Heads will roll. But we must dress the holly fint in the room. You can see how you avoid looking at me. I must be so terribly mutilated after all these decades of torture. It's normal to me. Oh, is this my dialogue? Looks like it. Yep, I see you. I'd blush if they had left me any skin to redden, and I would kiss you if they had not torn off my lips. She's just crazy, that's all. <laughs> yeah, she's kind of crazy. After what she's been through, kind of understandable. We'll carve our way to the entrance <clears throat> hall and chop rock. Oh, they were nightmares. Asses. 
That's the hopeful version, of course. The likely version uh, is that we the masses, and he is the chopper. Onward. That was the scroll I gave you. Explained that she went crazy because he forced all these nightmares into her. Oh, okay. Hey, I didn't actually realize they were nightmares. Time. I thought he actually did it to her. Okay. Now which way? All right, I guess I don't need this big ass hammer on my back anymore. Now we go and we refill our spell slots, and then we exit. Hammer to it, Craig. It's a one-handed yeah. hammer. Oh. What's so it look like? Um, I mean, it looks like. It like it looks like it could be a two-handed hammer. It does kind of look like that. But if we put it on Crag, experience. Jeez. that's what it looks like. Yeah, it looks kind of cool, but is it versatile? Um, I think it. It is. It uh, is versatile, but he he has that uh, legendary he sword can use though. A two sword. He can use it two-handed if it's versatile. It's yeah, say, but even it, so, um... it's a not nearly as good. I want to try it on. Uh, yeah, you can take it. Really yeah, just grab it. Are... Oh, I, know, I didn't even think about that, but yeah, it's totally yours if if you'll use it or if you want to use it, go for it. There, I sent it to you. It should be in your inventory now. I mean, as far as damage goes, it's definitely a lot better for damage than what you have. Yeah, it's damage is better, but it, not its utility. Yeah, its utility is definitely not as good. So, I mean, you can keep them both, and depending on what you feel like doing, maybe you can swap them around or something. So now what are we doing? Now we're exiting. Get the hell out of here before uh, Raphael gets back. Wait, where's back. The, the bathtub? You got it, I think. Oh. Did you not get it? Uh, it's back this way if you didn't get it. Sorry, I thought we all kind of went there. It's this way. And don't we owe that person outside a uh, artifact? Uh, we owe her those gloves. Oh, well, we're going to kill in her then. <laughs> I thought you didn't believe in killing vendors. Uh, I've already looted these. You didn't say we owed the gloves. Oh. Is she a vendor even? Yeah, she's a vendor. That's where I bought the cloak that I have and the uh, gloves that I'm wearing. Well, I definitely don't want to give her the gloves. Okay, in this one instance, I don't mind killing a vendor. In this one instance? No, 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 no. Come on now. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta stand for what you believe in. No, none of this oh, wishy-washy stuff. In, it's not being wishy-washy. It's what's best for my character. Right, what's best for yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's whatever mood you're in. It's, I, I want to complain about Chris, so I'll have this rule for that, but not now. i about you. Oh, come on. You refuse to see. I fully accept the facts. Readily. All the time. Alright, we made it. Let's go. Time slows for a moment, and the air becomes nope. thicker. The master of the house is coming. You. Sell out his henchmen. All right, so we want to try to knock the girl out with non-lethal damage. 
if we can. If we can't, oh well. There are many things in your world that I loathe. Litters of kittens, chattering children, the noise, and the chaos of it all. In my world, in my house, there is order, and there is decorum. You came here uninvited, and you stole from me. In doing so, you brought the chaos of your world into mine. I will not abide it. Yeah, go with number one. <laughs> oh, uh... Number one. Number three. I didn't need to. It was very entertaining watching you dig your own grave. I permitted you the freedom to decide your own fate. You could have been smart, selfless, saved the world. Instead, you came here and risked everything to save it's the world. It's the fatal flaw of mortal kind. Take away their free will and they call you a tyrant. Allow them to indulge it and they become tyrants. You would have been heroes if you'd only dealt fairly with me. Instead, you're not so different to doomed Cassus, overreaching your limits and burning your world to ash. Wrong, wrong, wrong! They will save their world and smash you to smithereens. It's this charming naivety that makes your company such a joy to me, Hope. I'll even forgive this little rebellion. Once you're suitably chastised. This isn't a rebellion. It's a revolt. I'm revolting. <laughs> the word that differently. Dies <laughs> today. Commander, you can salvage a trophy from these insects when I'm done with them. These insects struck me down beneath the Shadowlands. They are worthy opponents. Their skulls will make fine trophies. All right, corn. <laughs> skulls for the skull throne. Go for it. Persuade him. You mistake efficiency and strategy for cowardice. <laughs> It will be your last mistake. If you have any last words, make it quick. It will only take a moment to finish you. That is not true. This is going to be the longest battle in the game. It always burns you in the end, little mouse. <clears throat> now, down. focus on Raphael and it's written automatically. Yeah, 3 did something that they started doing. Like, I used to have the option to turn it on or off, but now I only have the option to choose, like, the frequency. And I have it set down to the lowest frequency right now, so sorry about that, but it's the best I can do. Some blesses in here. Yeah, I'm last again. Yeah. Yeah, you are mighty, but you're not very quick. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, whatever. Hell, hell. You need that plus two. Has its wars. Hell, hell. Fine, you can have it. But hold your applause. For now, down here come the claws. Let me know when you're done. Life's Let's see, yes, uh, slashing resistance, piercing resistance, bludgeoning, fire. 
should be immunity. So it can't do fire damage to him. Yep. Lightning resistance, cold resistance, poison resistance. This song goes hard. I like this song. Oh yeah, agreed, Jose. Attach the soul thrillers. That could be bought, doomed, detected, and caught. Are you done? Yeah, I'm just thinking I'm gonna have to I'm gonna try and see if I can attack a soul pillar instead of him. Yeah, you can. No more deals, it's over. The final act, you're done. Alright. Well, if you're done, then I'm going. Race. It's over. This house of hope. Well, one soul pillar down. Does hit points drop? No, they don't affect his hit points. They affect his soul charges. He can use soul charges for like super abilities. Speaking of good songs, has anyone heard Scar Productions cover of Down by the River? So good. I mean, Down by the River is a pretty awesome song. I'm not sure about their production of it. I heard a metal cover version of it. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm not the biggest fan of metal, so I probably would like the original better. Damn it. It sucks going last. Well, Hope's on our side, right? Yeah, she's on our side. We actually get the controller. Was she at level 10 cleric? And I don't know what level she is, but she has amazing cleric spells. Yeah, it says she's level 10. When these guys hit, they do a lot of damage. Yeah, yep. Pretty good damage. Pretty good damage. Alright, finally. You should put up a uh, swirly thingy, and then you have the uh, that black hole thing. Pull them into it. Uh, I already used the black hole thing. Hmm. That sucks. Okay. All right. Nice job with the vengeful cambion. That actually helps me out a uh, quite a bit. Sorry, Vakir, I swear that was not touching you on my screen. Damn it. Doesn't look like she really got hurt. Well, she took 16 damage. Oh, no, I guess she took 8. I thought it said 16. Probably 16, but she saved and only took half. Um, I've got yeah, frost maybe. resistance. Ah, uh, there you go. There you go. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're frost breathing everybody, right? That's right. All right, where's my healing at?
Okay, we should be able to... She has an ability where she can, uh, like, permanently banish one of the guys from this fight. So, yeah. So, that one's just gone. Eh, nobody's really hurt, right? Well, you are, but Ow. I can't actually Ow. heal you from there. I'm going to take a potion as soon as it's my turn. Okay. How many times do you have to hit those things to destroy them? Me? Twice, maybe. Raphael. Raphael's final act. Nice, nice. I gotta get the soundtrack for this game. It's got some pretty cool music. Although right now it's just kind of the regular generic. He's not immune to psychic damage. Nope. I used a crossbow for that. The sword's still on the ground, it looks like. Now, where did he go? I don't know. Apparently, he can disappear or something. Oh, yeah. We're definitely doing this. Well, here's hoping they actually attack each other a bit. Yeah, hopefully. Whatever they do, it'll be better than what they were going to do, probably. One day I'll catch a break. Did she do a group heal there? Yeah, she can do this right here, which should be pretty badass. Yep. There. Yep. Yeah, I was hoping that we could get her in my party, like like in my single player playthrough. Like, dude, she has some awesome spells. I don't know what she is, a life cleric maybe or something. But she does have some nice spells. She also, we can do that divine intervention thing that a cleric gets. 
to give her a legendary weapon and then we can drop it and actually take the legendary weapon for ourselves. So um, we might want to do that at you some point in this battle. Do that. You can also theoretically do that by just hiring mercenaries. Hire them, cast a spell, then dis take the weapon and then dismiss them and do it again with the next one. Supposedly. Hmm. They you, just re them in, you just respec them into clerics? Yeah. Interesting. I don't think there's much. I'm... Let's see. Anybody have any idea who Hope follows? I don't know. Will it tell me? I guess I need to go with Crag first and then worry about that. It comes easy these days. You want me to continue focusing on these pillars? Yeah, I would just go for the pillars. They're all confused anyways, so screw it. Why not? Apparently, if they're confused, they still get attacks of opportunity. And I'll keep hitting with their attacks of opportunity. That's okay. We've got two healers, plus a bunch of potions. It'll be fine. Yeah, so I'm not sure who her deity is. It doesn't tell me here. And I don't have any way to go look at her. Uh, she is a disciple of life. I think it's Lathlander. Lathander? Yeah. Yeah, maybe so. That would make sense. Well, I can't get close enough. I will have to shoot. Maybe there's something better to shoot, though. Yeah, Matsy confirms that the god is Lathander. No, don't kill her. That we're supposed we to want to knock her. her. No, we want to knock her out. Isn't she going to try and take my gloves? No, if you'd been paying attention to chat, we could make an intimidation check so she doesn't get your gloves. Anyways, I'm pretty sure once Raphael's influence over her is done, she doesn't give a damn about any of that stuff. If she's just dead, then she doesn't give a damn about it at all. But okay. She's not dead yet. Well then you Well then you should have shot her if that's how you really feel. <laughs> I did shoot her. Again. Oh. Yeah, keep doing stuff that makes us use our psionic blasts on you, buddy. Yeah, the psionic blast is pretty pretty decent damage. Well, there he is. All right, he's got to die. He's annoying. Yeah, he took my cambion pet away from me. Bastard. Yeah, but you got another thing to deal with there. I love that spell. What's that? Oh, that? Yeah, that, that, that is amazing. Yeah, it is amazing, for sure. Imagine a party of all clerics just running around with that. Yeah, I'm sure just it would be uh, pretty group. strong. Really, it healed him? What the hell? 
Weak. Where did you cast at him? Um. Uh, oh, ice ray. Wild magic. I don't know. Maybe wild magic did go off or something. She's a she's a good healer. All right, level up. All right, then we shouldn't have to worry about any of his super bullshit. I won't be hurt by those things, will I? Surely not. Now we just need to hit her with some non-lethal damage. I'll try to do that this turn if I can. Oh, thank you for the help. Into the area effects spells again. <laughs> no, it's confused and it flew over there. Nice. Confused, but it's all attacking the same, our party member. No, it actually attacked the Cambion first, and then it attacked our party member. It did two attacks. Oh, more Sonic damage. Damn it, he's invisible again. That guy is annoying. Yeah. Uh, can't Craig see him with his invisibility? I don't know. I he definitely don't see him one right now, but the, uh, yeah, the Cambion. Okay. okay. <laughs> no, let me, uh, let me see if I can. No, she's dead. All right, never mind. We killed her. Oh, she needed to die. Sure, I guess. Her Sorry, judgment Hope. Your, has been your sister's hatched. forever dead. Yeah, her judgment for what she did while under the charm of a devil. He still did it. Against her will. It, may not have been it wasn't against her will. Her will. She was uh, happily playing along. Yeah. Because Hope. Seems like a. She Seems resisted. like a mighty large assumption there, Mrs. Uh, oh, Lawful Hope good. resisted. If Hope can do it, then Kirilla should have as well. Oh, well, taking care of those uh, pillars made them easier to hit, that's for sure. What's up, Pondor? Sorry, I just noticed that you got in here. I've been uh, not paying too much attention to chat, it seems. I need to get better at this job. Uh, I'm not going to use that on... Do we get to use this every time someone uses a spell or just once a round? Once a round. It's a reaction, so once a round. Yeah, so we shouldn't use it because then we uh, can save it for him. Um... I, I don't think there's really any chance that we could possibly lose here. Like, I'm not worried about it. That's not even my final form. Nope. Uh, 
you were saying. Ugh. Yeah, well, we'll be fine. That's what I was saying. I didn't ignore you, I just didn't know that you were here. There's a large difference. Is he the only one left standing? Uh, no, Hope you're left too? standing. Vakira's left standing. Hope might be dead. Yeah, Hope might be dead. Yeah, Hope's dead. Oh, I can't heal her. Nope, she's gone. Take care. Yeah, well, and as you'll see, there will be no loss, Pondor. There will be no loss. But y'all should be used to that by now. How many times has that happened? Target. Only in reality, Pondor. Only in reality. There it goes. It's Frieza? Yeah. Eh, I don't think it really looks much like Frieza. Did I knock him down? Um, I don't know. Did you? Yeah, it's prone. He's prone. Oh, nice. Oh, he severed the soul of hope. Nice. Poor hope. The best of us is God. Yeah, three more. No, it's only two more, because Frieza had four forms, three transformations, right? Pretty sure. I don't know. It's been a long time. I could be wrong. It's hard to target. Yeah. Oh, no, that was pretty easy to target. That was pretty easy to target. Oh, come off it. <laughs> I had it on his body. Sorry, man. Uh, don't apologize to me. Apologize to Unsung. Uh. Well, I tried to counter it, but I failed. I mean, that shit, that's going to annoy me. Light on my feet. Like, I'm targeting things through him. Yeah, that is uh, pretty annoying. We just have to make sure there's nothing behind him then. He's almost at half hit points. And Golden Frieza must not have been during my time. That must have been later, huh? Oh, that was a Dragon Ball Super. 
Yeah, I didn't watch Super GT. I just watched Dragon Ball Z. Yeah, that's why, that's why I said after my time. Is it my turn? I have three bonus actions. Those. No key left. Fire damage is not a good thing. Nope, just punch the crap out of him. Yeah, considering I might be in melee with him for a while by myself, I'm thinking of putting Blur on. Well, he's confused, yeah. so hopefully he doesn't get too many attacks off on you. Hopefully. Here, we'll use his portrait to attack him. That sounds like fun. Quick question. If you drop a healing potion between two of you close together. Yes, you can heal two people at once with by like throwing a healing potion. I have never been able to get it to work on more than two at once, though. Even if it shows like it'll hold, it'll heal three or four. It still only heals two. I knocked him down again. Good job. Good job. The Cell Saga was great. I actually like the Saiyan Saga the most, but yeah, Cell Saga probably the next most after the Saiyan Saga. The Cell Saga was pretty cool. I like the way that uh, Trunks became more powerful than Vegeta, but then it blew up in his face and he was actually less effective because of it. I think that thing's trying to attack, uh... Oh, yeah, I think I screwed up there. Yeah. I think I missed you, punk. Who's a mere mortal now? I thought you had to... Okay, that's a good question. Uh, I'm not sure. I don't think it works if you just drop it. If you just drop it, then it's laying on the ground. Like, you have to destroy it somehow by throwing it or attacking it or something. I'm pretty sure. At least as far as I'm aware. You guys still confused? He is awesome. Is that Cambion dead yet? No. Really? Why do you take damage? Mm, not sure. Says he was hit for twenty two fire damage. Is he on fire? I mean, I didn't think so, but maybe this guy has a fire aura or something. I don't know. I'm standing beside him. I'm not taking any damage. I don't. Well, think I'm, I'm not. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. It just says he took 22 fire damage, though. He seems weak to being knocked over. Thank you. Yep. Doomed 
detected and caught. While you're oh, while you're in the firing, and then it would have broke. Yeah, that actually would have been a pretty good idea. Yeah, that would have been a really good idea. Uh, two ladies, it would have been. Fortunately, my brain doesn't work that uh, well. I guess. Well, he's down to 133. Chris, I got one last. Huh. What to do with that third action? Shoot him? I don't yeah, I have no him. idea about the that. Y'all are beyond me now. Don't you attack yourself, huh? This guy hits like a halfling. Like a halfling? What? That is not what I wanted to do. Damn it. Now maybe Craig can kill him. Yeah, maybe. There's something maybe. going on with him. I wonder what. Okay, it says he's threatened, but that's just disadvantage on attack rolls. He doesn't have anything that's showing up as a negative. He's got a severed soul. Ah. Sixty-six of six sixty-six hit points. He's almost down. He's almost defeated. And we finally got our eleventh level after all of this, which will be awesome. That's it, buddy. Too much to Seems like. Fifty damage, guys. You can do it. Move up till your thing hits him. Your. Oh, do those not damage him? Come on, roll big, roll big, roll big, roll big. Actually, uh, I can't do that. Damn. Oh well, yeah, I can do that. I can do that, and then this. Boom! Got him. With its master gone. All right. Yep, yeah, we are we are in the double digits, Pondor. You don't have to imagine it. You're here. You can live vicariously. Who wears heavy armor? Uh Bakira. That would be high. Yeah, the armor he drops is insane. Yeah, it's 21. super awesome. I don't I know if she wants armor. to wear I don't know if she wants to wear devil's armor though. 
you are considered proficient with this armor while wearing it, so anybody could wear it. Yeah, yeah, anybody could wear it. Oh, I wonder if I could get that all the stack. Oh, we're love. Ooh, nice. I gotta go back to uh, Withers and do a respec. If it lets me level up. Finally, pick up Hollow Knight. Oh, yeah, yeah, everybody congratulate uh, Pondor because he is the winner. Apparently, there's like a three day waiting period before you can send somebody a gift card on Steam, though. So, just an FYI, if, yeah, if um, whoever does win, like, it's probably going to take like three or four days to actually get you your gift card, whoever wins next. Oh yeah, I got Heroes Feast. That's good. Yeah, it's a really good spell. Ritual. Nice. Nice. Class of twenty two. Don't you lose like all the stuff from your dexterity and your wisdom, though, for wearing that? Oh, I haven't put it on yet. Oh, no, okay. I just added my constitution bonus to my armor class. Ah, okay. Oh, you're gonna you're gonna lose that too. Yeah. Get no AC bonus from Dex, so if I put that on, my armor class would be 21. And yeah, so you're actually lowering your armor class with it. You would succeed. Probably not throw great. The you would burning damage for three turns. You have resistance to fire damage. You cannot be burned. You take three less damage from all sources. If you're proficient in it, you should wear this. Me. Yeah, maybe I should. I don't know. If it's here, it doesn't want you it. A, you lose a plus one bonus to spell saves, but your armor class goes to 21. You become immune yeah. to fire damage. Yeah, if I'm sold. That's control. actually probably a pretty good idea. All right, check out the uh, the, the food icon on your, your character. The food icon? Thoroughly stuffed. The affected entity is immune to diseases, poisons, and being frightened. It makes all wisdom saving throws with advantage, and its maximum hit points are increased. Oh, hell yes! That was the best, greatest meal of my entire life. Thank you, Vakira. That is amazing. You can do it every day for us now. Did you guys hell yeah, that, in here? that's badass. Uh, I think so. I don't know. Double check me, but probably. I'm going to go restore all my spell slots and everything one last time. What's in here? I may have actually gone the wrong way to do so, but oh well. What did Hope have on or anything? Uh, she had a quarter staff and that was it. Um, and her sister? Where's it at? Uh, I'm not even sure about her sister. Why do I? Oh. Okay, you sent me the hell desk armor, I guess. Yes. Um. Let's see. Yeah, she had this. No, that's not the. That's the one that I took off. I'll be right back. 
Maybe I didn't or we pick it up. Or we could armor but... to Craig because then he becomes proficient in it. But one moment. Yeah, but he can't. Uh, he can't rage in heavy armor. I want to find it eventually. Here it is. Oh yeah, that hit point boost is nice. Nice, nice. <laughs> That's the funny number. <laughs> Yeah. 60, uh, 69 hit points. Hit the nail on the head. We can all be happy now. It's like I'm back in middle school. So is this awesome armor you were talking about? Huh? Yeah, the hell desk armor here. Here, I just sent it to you. Try it on your character. See if you like it. Because it should prob probably go to you first before anybody, if you'll actually use it. Oh my gosh, yes. It looks pretty cool. And then it's got a lot of really nice abilities. Looks kind of gross. <laughs> really? I thought it looked pretty cool, but... If you don't look the way it looks, then... Oh. It's just your anti-devil like... status uh, <laughs> shining through there. You're like, I don't want to be devilish. Yeah, 26 AC, though. I'll, I'll... 26 Fine. AC is pretty nice. Yeah, it had me all the way up to 23. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm that's back. that's definitely nice. Did you guys leave? Uh, No. No, you were taking a bath. Yep. Right. I'm gonna leave, and then I'm gonna go respec. Okie dokie. Oh, we all have to go? Um, I guess so. All right, well, we're going to have a short intermission while you're respecking and doing that, because... Oh, damn it. Right, we have a cutscene first. limb, and freedom. All to steal the Orphic Hammer. I hope your ambitions end there. I have already told you that the Githyanki Prince only wants to see you dead. But it seems you still do not trust me. Don't worry, Sam loves you, so we're not going to do it. That is not my definition of trust. You are falling into the same trap as the Chosen. Their distrust of one another is their undoing. We must not make the same mistake. We must work together. you felt you needed to have it at all tells me that you are not worthy of that trust nonetheless our fates are bound and in the absence of a happier union i will accept a useful one you Man, may is he gaslighting us genius for having slain the devil yeah you have merely ironed out a wrinkle. i don't know i would the kill him pain. if not for sam would be such an easy foe it is time we resume our journey to find it. All we need is the cutscene where he offers us the final uh, tadpole so we can turn into lithids. 
and then we're fine. Then after that, we can kill him. All right, we'll see. We'll see if uh, how that goes down. All right, I'll be right back. Fish. We're going to have a short intermission, people. Appreciate everybody for uh, hanging out and everything. But give me like uh, 10 minutes. I got to go grab a drink and just uh, take a few minutes to do something. Um, so, yeah.
All right, I'm back. I just got back to. Okay, cool. We got anybody left out there? <clears throat> you get your respect done? Pretty much, yep. Nice. All right, we're, uh, I don't know where we're going or what we're doing next, but uh, I guess we're ready to do it, whatever it is. We want to keep playing without Craig. Here's a level. Oh, I saw that I mean, they were planning to uh, address that issue and allow uh, player characters to be removed from the party temporarily in the like next patch that we're going on. That they didn't already do that. I mean, it's up to y'all. If y'all want to stop here, we can stop, or I'm good to keep going for probably a couple more hours if you want. Tempers are rising. It's clear not everything you find is at your disposal. Oh, she's still here. Okay, I guess she. She's gonna want the gloves after all. Is that different people? It's Corella. Corilla. Yeah, so yeah, they look so similar. Another. I thought that they were the Especially same. Especially when the traveler she causes the kind them. of trouble you did. I knew you were a thief. Didn't realize you were a killer. Raphael's I'm a killer death thief. is already causing quite a stir across the hells. It's a rare thing for a mortal to slay a devil of his stature. No, Pondor's gone. I hope no, what are okay? We got in the stream. No, Pondor. Do you have the gauntlets? Everything I took from the house is mine. We had a deal. I just killed a devil in his own house. You really Give don't want to test my patience. Dead. Killed him in his home realm, so he's a Not a dead subtle dead. point, but well made. Keep the gauntlets. Your threats aren't necessary. But your Sell her the gauntlets is still now. welcome. Devil Slayer. <laughs> yeah. I'm proud from Ravinda's cold dead fingers. Hands, whatever. Well, and we still kept her as a vendor. Cool. Yeah, I don't really know what to do from here on, so I'm just kind of wandering around. A good mason turns up for work. Obviously, dusk was the story Magic my hair. <laughs> Gotta accessorize. It's important. It is. I picked up an infernal marble. What's that for? Uh, that was one of the things we needed to open the uh, the hell gate. Oh. It was one of the ingredients. I picked it up. It's just we're in uh, his realm. Yeah, I, somebody said earlier that you can actually find everything that you need, like to open the hell gate, actually in her house, like hidden away in different places or something. 
I don't know. But I don't know if they have any other use or not. Oh, I found a bunch of miffets. Interesting. And an absolute cultist. Oh, yeah, I want to battle some miffets and oozes. Yeah, where are you at? I went down a manhole over here. Let me let me come back out so you can see me on the map. All right, you see me? I was going to camp. Give me a moment. Sure, sure. If you teleport to the lower city central wall, it's kind of close by. It's definitely the closest place. Mifits are usually fun to fight. I like the way they go kablooey. Yeah, after what, killing an archdevil, we get our asses kicked by some nephits. <laughs> That'd be so awesome. I hope we die. Uh. Ah, it's Bakira. Okay. Manhole's this way for the Mifits. I was just kind of wandering around uh, a bit. It should be right up here. not here I've just been told to stay away from a gate yeah I think that uh, that's us it's actually it's actually this way I went the wrong way whoops Listen to me. if you go any further the brain will dominate us we are not ready okay we're not ready I got it I got it I got it there it is found it I suppose saving is not a terrible idea. I'm not sure when the last time we had an auto save was. Trying to find you. Oh, you were really close to us earlier whenever I was looking on the map. Where did you go? Oh, you're here. You're right by us. All right, let's go. Okay, I can't see us. Just give me a moment here. Are you lagging You're again? That manhole right there? Yeah, the manhole. Did you go for a swim earlier? Nah, don't know how to swim. <laughs> uh, must have been some other oozing, stinking lump floating downstream. Wow, really? They're still only level four? What are we supposed to be doing? Wizard told us to watch for troublemakers. But we are troublemakers. Oh, maybe we don't have to fight them. What's this, cousin? Or maybe we do. Another absolutist <laughs> come to see what we did to poor old Sarin. Your god took her mind, cultist, so Vareki took her head. And I burned the flesh from her bones. And now you come to interrupt the funeral rites. I... Reese Elemental? Yes, cousin. An excellent idea. Cousin says we will take you in return. 
He says you look just like kindling for Sarin's funeral pyre. Of course you don't. Sarin, Bereki, and I <coughs> made our coin by going unnoticed. The finest thieves in the city. Until we messed with Gortash and he sent the cult after us. Your fellow cultists hunted us, so we hid down here. We were safe, and so was our loot. Until the darkness soured Sarin's mind. She kept our treasure from us. Said Bereki and I had gone strange. Hush, cousin. Sarin turned into a cultist herself, so we did what we had to. Bereki wept until his voice was gone, and then he was gone too. Leaving only me to conduct Sarin's rites. And my cousins here. You cannot conduct the rites without a clan to bear witness. Or some fuel for the fire. Continue, Buck. A hit one. It's a dragonborn option. You're right. It must be a cleansing fire. A pure one. <coughs> I took Sarin's life. I must be sure she does not lose her soul as well. Pass then, and do not come back. This is Sarin's final resting place and a killing ground. Well, I didn't realize that was going to get us out of combat. I just thought it was the cool choice since you were a dragonborn. What's the name of that river down there? I mean, there's Isn't some creepy the stuff back there. Earth. Well, are we proceeding or what? Impressive. And it tastes great. All sorts of methods and elemental things. <laughs> Yeah, should be uh, quite interesting. Don't know how to swim. Yeah. Uh, the the other side looks kind of empty. Well, you want to continue by them, or do you want to kill them, or what? Oh, it gives us more XP. Well, hmm. we know the answer to that. But we are troublemakers. Keep your mucky little peepholes peeled. Look at it. This one way. Damn it. Frickin' grease, man. Oh boy. Yeah, he's not here. Jelly cubed. There's no crag with us today, so we're keeping him at level 10. He can do his level on Thursday, I suppose. <coughs> okay. Weak. <coughs> well, apparently I'm not very good at grease. Anybody got any fire? Somewhere. Yeah, we can blow the whole lot of us up. The old man dust combined. Seems like it should just kill all of them, like they would just burn. But I don't actually know. Well, let's see if the grease ball turns into a fireball. It's going to. I chained reacting up to them too. Yeah, I thought you were gonna shoot it that way at them, but yeah, it went all the way up there to them anyways, so didn't really do much damage, but maybe as they're moving through it it will. Locked Guess we'll have to see. Oh, did it? I miss I missed that one. Well the weird crazy <coughs> cultist type didn't do anything to it, but but the grease ball it knocked down by half. Oh, the one that you targeted, yeah. Yeah.
Oh, you're out of here, Yomogami. Also, what's up, Jelly Cube? Nice see you to stop by. Hope you have a good night, Yomogami. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, six hit points left. Yeah, they're taking fire damage up there. Very nice, very nice. Oh, Magma Mifits. Didn't realize that he had summoned Magma Mifits. Yep, like four of them. If I do this, it's going to explode all over all of us. I was hoping that would be enough to kill the Magma Mythids, but it was not. Almost. I don't think the summoned ones explode. No? I thought they Jen would. Killed more, maybe didn't go explode on her. Time to push my no. luck again. I guess I should have been paying more attention. I didn't notice her kill it. Yeah, I guess it didn't explode. Well, that's just less fun.
Oh. Is that a fireball? Damn, there are a lot of them. Yeah, but they're simple. No, there's little guys. Yeah. Oh. Heat metal. No, there is a problem with wearing armor. Hey, don't forget, everybody, if you haven't already done so, please hit those thumbs up button, give us some likes, help get this out to as many people as possible, and uh, if you're not already subscribed, go ahead and give us a sub, and thank you so much to our uh, new Lorespire channel member supporters. Y'all are awesome. Really? Yeah. Well, that's good. Just where I wanted to be. Did he teleport you? Or your wild and my magic wild magic tell him. Yeah, my wild magic teleported me. I tried to counterspell him, and I guess the counterspell failed, but it still swapped us. <clears throat> Be nice if counter spells were all automatic. At least against lower level spells.
Well, that's one of them, uh, yeah, Chris. All right, you done? No. Okay. Oh, go for it. I'm gonna only take half damage from elements, if they even. Hear <laughs> Good saving throws, so I don't take damage if I make it, and I only take half, and then half again. Nice, nice, very nice, for sure. Where do I go from here? Shouldn't have made me your enemy. Immune to paralyzed, really? He's got two hit points left. He ain't gonna make it much longer, anyways. General crush. What's that? He has freedom of movement on him. Ah, that's why the paralyzed. It. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Unsung needs a freaking ranged weapon. I mean, I guess he can throw weapons, but he's not nearly as good as that is what he used to be. Oh, this is an item where you insert something in here. Probably her head. Could be. That would make sense. Not sure where her head is, but it might be on the body of the guy. Yeah, yeah, that's the pretty good, uh, pretty good bet, I guess. Have to keep going. Is it there? Nope, but he does have a. Key. Does have a key? Short rests or anything? Yeah, we can do a short rest, I guess. Uh, I don't know. There's still a good bit of this place left that we haven't messed with. I guess it could be part of that. And there's still more grease ball things over here. Also, there's doors that we've not been going through. That's curious. Just locked, Victor. I'm just wandering around looking for a head. Nothing in here is hostile to us, even though there are a lot of things left. Oh, I found a locked door.
was locked. Oh, there's like some type of a uh, trolley car, sewer boat, something. I found another key that was hidden. Oh, nice. I found somebody. And another scroll of cloud kill. Ooh, clap kills nice. Ah, a friendly face at last. Are you going to the party as well? I don't know if um, there's say, something called a cranium rat right over here and it's got glowing eyes. Oh go on then, I'll tell you. Like blue. It's an underground glowing. party at a place called Does it look fun to fight? Palace. My date's supposed to uh, now looks like an animal you need no to talk to. Him. You haven't seen uh. him, have you? Pale, skinny, extremely <clears throat> piercing eyes. The individual descriptions could refer to many things, but taken together, she can only be referring to something vampiric in nature. It's funny. He was ever so keen for me to come. He didn't seem the type to cancel. Only that it was him and a few of his closest friends. Said he couldn't wait to introduce me to them. How often does a man say that to a girl he's only met once? He was so enthusiastic. I don't understand why he hasn't shown up. Oh, that kid found me again. A vampire? No, <laughs> he wasn't. Was he? But then, why am I still here? He could have had me what by the neck any time you liked. Yeah, I was just roaming around the sewers and he like you ran up and I was like, Hey, you, you gotta help you know me! What? I might give this party a miss. Plenty more fish in the Chionthar, as they say. If you see him, don't tell him I was here. Just tell him I... Um, oh, I wasn't ready to be in a relationship. I'm sure he'll understand. Oh my god. Something bad's happening? Uh, yeah. Yeah, really bad. She found me and my cat Grub snatched I think that psycho lady's down here with us. Either that or that's her right there. Could be either. Yeah, I think Oren's near nice. us. Well, we were supposed to find Oren. Maybe we did. Yeah, I'm going to hang out until you guys get, get over here. Oh, I'm just like listening I'm in on the conversation. Here. Okay. Yeah, if All she's right, like I right guess. behind him, I'm not going to be able to solo her. I don't think. I think she's... I think we don't fight her until we get her into the Temple of Baal, which might be down here. Huh? I got a looter during the fight. Yeah, you were right. Alright, do you still need me or not? I want her outfit. I wonder if we can take it. Probably not. I could peel a fine pelt from the mud I caught sniffing at your heels. Drag skin. I will not slice. Her kind die too easily. The murder lord demands a better offering. 
something new. Sticky, sweet, and delicious. He wants you. Silly little worm. My god is always with me. He shudders to see how my blades plunge into soft, surrendered flesh. You are dull. A blunt blade unfit to flay. But you could be sharpened, thin and jagged. Yes, I will tell you what to do. No, no. Not here. Not now. The tyrant must fall first. Of course she wants us to kill her. Yep. What's his name? You heard Gortash's whispers. I see how your skull swarms with his promises. <clears throat> He whinges and wails over the crown of Carsus, wanting to command it without me. Oh, how I long to slit his poxy smile from ear to ear. But I can't touch him. He bound my blade when we first conspired. Gortash didn't want me at first. Didn't trust me. Got me to wag my tongue, swear an oath never to hang him from the hooks. Drip drain him into father's open jaws. You must kill the tyrant. Take the Netherstone from his corpse and bring it to my temple. Yeah, yep, we they both want us to do the same thing. Shred each other. Yep. The survivor claims the stones. What's left of the other is bars. Agree, and I will bring my assassins to heal. They watch you always, longing to spray the crimson Not happening, from lady. your veins. Refuse me, and you'll learn what happens to those who defy Baal's doctrine. So will your friend. Oren demands a fight to the death. The prize for the victor, the nether stones, and the chance to control the crown alone. Accept, and you must kill Gortash. Refuse, and the child's life may be forfeit. As might your own. Orin's assassins will hunt you like prey for slaughter. little slaughter hound my assassins will not let you if you hunt me then they hunt you the murder lord will not be denied neither will i oh yeah he can be you kick his ass in most games now we just gotta find wherever her temple is I don't know, but we found the Undercity, apparently. A rush of ancient whispers fills your mind There's as you approach the door. It is right. A new vessel brimming with blood darkens. Hits the uh, the other member of that party of killed skull, their slowly. friend. Do you have proof of your faith to our Lord? I think I found the Temple of Baal. There's a door here that just spoke to me and said that uh, I have to prove myself to Baal or something for the door to open by spilling blood in his name or I don't know. Something to that effect. I got the words wrong, but something to that effect. You must bear proof of the Dreadlord. Oh shit, he's a... Uh... Or pay his toll of blood. He does have some light armor. Uh, that gives plus two armor class. And advantage on saving throws against spells. Oh, that's if you're in wild shape. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Time to 
press ahead. Oh, this guy's a merchant? News to me. Yeah, uh, the... The helmet, uh, for crack. Is that something he might use? I don't know, I have to take a... Look, it's on the merchant? The permission yeah. looks at you silently. Penitent looks at you silently, expectantly. Um, let's see. Bone spike helmet, fury in the marrow. When you rage, hostile creatures in a three meter radius must succeed a wisdom saving throw or take psychic damage. Targets receive half damage on a save. Intimidation plus two and gives menacing attack. Um, possibly, possibly. How do we get to our reactions again? Uh, the bottom right, just above, like, where your items and stuff are on the hot bar, you sh if you click one of those little symbols, it should take you to your reactions. See what he currently has. You gain a plus two bonus to attack rolls when attacking creep. Eh. I mean, I don't know. He might use it, but I actually think what he has right now is better. And it looks like the other one's like a druid item kind of thing. And Craig does he come with by the way. Yeah, I'm selling a bunch of stuff right now. Oh, I found a treasure room. No, oh, treasure rooms are usually good. And traps, so I'm not stepping in. <laughs> I didn't see which direction you went. You're not on my map. There you are. This passageway? I didn't force you guys to come in there, did I? Didn't force me. I'll just stay outside while you uh, look around for traps. Okay, well, all it did was the trap was a whole bunch of undead. Oh, okay. I'll be right well, there. Well, that's good. We love undead. <laughs> uh... They locked us out, too. Yeah, this might be a bit of an issue. There's a lot of undead in here. All right, what now? Don't worry, I got it. 
I'm all over. Okay. Let me, uh, wait, 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 wait. Let me remove this curse. Let's switch my damage to Radiant. No one stopped me yet. Okay, a bunch of them are crawling crawling hands, which have four hit points. The zombies have uh, 85. Alright, well, the door's open. Can you not remove the curse? Okay, nice, nice, awesome. Vinker is Hell yeah. Still alive. Ah, I love having a cleric in the party. <clears throat> I got the left side. Mm. Oh, survival is all that matters. Ooh, casting a spell in here is bad. Yeah, apparently that curse is uh, just constant. Well, I'm not undead, but I don't use spells, so I'm okay. I just hit you for 28? Thought it said 2 to 12. Oh, per spell level. Uh, fun. Yeah, super yeah, fun. Still a pure physical fight. I wonder if it uh, <clears throat> works on scrolls, like if you cast a spell through a scroll. I would think it probably does, but possibly not. Possibly not. Unsung really needs greater weapon master. Like, he's rolling in the 30s like every freaking time he attacks. I can do over 100 points of damage in a turn. 
Very nice, very nice. I like this room. Spellcasters yeah, and very effect weapons would just wipe it out so easily. Yeah, yeah. This is the room that proves why you need your fighter types. Not to blow up the trailer. It won't blow up. It didn't even take damage. Chest's on fire. Yeah, and it also has full hit points and medium toughness. That water? It's holy, holy water. water ah, holy water. Okay, okay. Great for hurting undead and putting out fires. Apparently so. I wonder if it made a holy mist. Attacking music and exercise and futility for almost anything right now. panicked a little bit when I said I needed help. Yeah, you probably would have been fine. So. Yeah, well, that's uh, helpful, I would imagine.
I think you guys got that one, poor little schmuck. Yeah, well, there's two of them, but yeah. Yeah, I think we got them. I should have drank a potion. Let's see. Moving ahead. There's a magic spear just sitting in the middle of the thing. This yeah, breaching pike staff might be useful. I think you're the only one yeah. who can use it. It's well, I guess uh, he's a marshal, right? He can use it. Oh, I guess Jen can use it too. She's martial, has all the martial weapons. Yeah, it's. I mean, it's a two handed weapon with reach that does not have very good damage. And it's plus two. But that's about it. Like, no other abilities or anything. And we can sell it. Yep, it's definitely sell worthy. I know that this is a little bit earlier than what I said, but I'm freaking half falling asleep over here. Do y'all mind if we go ahead and stop it here? Yeah, it's fine. Don't mind it. Sounds good. Okay. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Freaking. Yeah, I still have to upload a video. I already recorded it earlier, but I haven't got it uploaded yet. So I still have to upload that before I go to bed too. So, um, okay, yeah, yeah, I think that this is probably. Yeah, yeah, let's go oh, to camp right. and rest. That uh, sounds like a good idea. Still special session for Thursday? Uh, yeah, yeah, you're off, right? You can make it? Unsung said he can yep. make Thursday. Alright, and you can make Thursday, right? Yep, and hopefully I can have my other computer working by then. <clears throat> yeah, I hope so. I really do hope so. Um, did you, you know, guys already go definitely to camp? sucks. Yeah, I did. Um... Yeah, on uh, Jen actually had this really good idea where um, where we all kind of create our character and make a picture of it, kind of like I did, and have like a little backstory for it. So on Thursday, since we'll all four be here, we should maybe talk a little bit uh, before the stream or after the stream, like about how we want our characters to be connected in the next one, and like what we're gonna do with that. Um, yeah. Anyways, I just wanted to throw that out there, so maybe it's something you can be thinking about um yeah all right i'll see y'all you lovely like people idea. on thursday yeah i think it's a really really cool idea but yeah see you on thursday jen hey matsy glad to see that you're still around and you're getting in your uh your entry all right anybody who doesn't know uh, we're giving away a 25 five dollar steam gift card mm -hmm. every thursday night so just uh, all you have to do is show up to the stream and type exclamation lore spire in order to join you can join once in in order to join the giveaway you can join once in the first five minutes of a stream once anytime during the middle of the stream and once in the last five minutes so even if you uh even if you already did join earlier you can do it again now 
uh, have another entry since we're in the last five minutes. Anyways, yeah, I think it's pretty cool, Matsy. Um, I mean, I shared mine with a little bit of a, a backstory the other day, and I guess Jen saw it, and she thought that it was a cool idea, so she wanted to do the same thing for her character. So I'm going to put that out on the channel so that y'all can see what her character is going to be and the backstory for it. And then if Unsung and Sam will do the same thing, we'll have all four of our characters up there like that, which I think would be pretty cool, pretty cool. Anyways, uh, Sam, you gonna you gonna hit the shops and do everything, or you wanna rest first, or what? Uh, I was going to hit the shops, but if you're tired, I don't have to. Uh, I mean, I still I still have to upload that. I still have to upload that video and stuff. So like, I mean, another twenty to thirty minutes or whatever, you know, is is fine because I still have to upload that video. I can just leave the game open while I'm doing that. It's not a problem. Alrighty. All right. So that's it. Thanks everybody for coming, for hanging out. Love all you guys. Y'all are awesome. Y'all make this all worth it. This has been Chris with Laura Spire. Be well, my friends. Excuse me. Oh, so you're not wearing that armor, eh? No, Jen took it.